Hello, everyone, and welcome to Disco Elysium. Hello! Yay! It's Disco <laughs> Wednesday, the most predictable day of the week. <laughs> Everybody <laughs> get down! What did I say? Everybody one down. It's always Disco Wednesday. <laughs> it's always. Every every Monday, people wake up going, all right, hump day, Disco's going to be there. <laughs> <laughs> Wiggle your disco hips. <laughs> Wiggle also, your disco hips. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for the anniversary wishes. That's really, really sweet. Happy really anniversary, nice. Allison. A what very you happy do? anniversary. Thank you. Well, Victor made a really, really lovely dinner. Um, I went. Uh, I did not bake. I didn't make anything. I just went to this. I went to our favorite bakery and I picked up treats. <laughs> that Honestly, was my contribution. Ideal. That is a good contribution. <laughs> but we're we're actually going out to celebrate on Sunday. We're going to a, a nice restaurant up in Napa. So I'm really I'm looking forward to that. That'll be very nice. What um, what number is this for you guys? This is two. This is our two year wedding two, anniversary. Baby. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, we've been to, but we've been together for eleven years. Gotcha. Um, okay. So it <laughs> it's it's very nice, though. I'm so happy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And you guys remade the cocktails from your wedding, which we made did me, do that. Like, oh, made me so happy. So it was cute. so sweet. I didn't see that. Yes, because oh. they had yes. like his and hers cocktails, and, and it was just really sweet. It made me smile. The way it should be, without a doubt. What are the cocktails, Allison? Um, mine is basically like a bourbon sweet tea, and then Ooh. Victor's is a um a paloma, like a grapefruit paloma. Oh my god, so good. Yeah. Oh, that's so cute. Mm-hmm. Yes, and Victor did it. I get no credit. He's right. <laughs> I I requested it, and then he did it. So. It was great, Victor. It made me smile, and I realized I'm not the audience. But <laughs> no, but look, I, I've been very vocal about how much I like Victor's just the aesthetics of his cocktails. Yeah. I haven't even had one yet. <laughs> <laughs> if I have one, Victor, the first time I have one, if it's not good, my hopes and dreams are going to be dead. For what it's worth, like I think I've had a grand total of, things. like, two <laughs> of his, of his look, recent, like, batch. Yeah. They look like they taste like a billion dollars. <laughs> they really do. <laughs> I do remember you know back I mean? in the They're day really great. in in college, uh, Victor. Whenever we played Tales of games, uh, Victor would make <laughs> like themed cocktails. Not themed around Tales of games. Some they were sometimes they were like Hogwarts houses and things like that. But yeah, like, yeah. Oh, those were good days. Yeah. <laughs> oh. the, the good yeah. days, baby. There were no worries back in college. Right? <laughs> God. <yeah. laughs> uh. <laughs> At least on Saturdays when we played. Uh, uh, tales of and drank Victor cocktails. <laughs> yeah, look, drinking in video games felt a different kind of way in college. I will say that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but thank you, everybody. This is really, really sweet. Um, makes me so happy. Um, how are you all doing? Uh, the two of you yeah, on stream. Like, <laughs> is that is that are we gonna at wait chat? For chat? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it could also be at chat. I, everybody, chat, let how, us know how, how you're doing. doing. I want to hear how you're doing, but in the meantime, we can share. Um, Well, I guess uh, it's been it's been chaotic. There's been a lot (laughs) going on. Um, uh, But I am going to be seeing my brother next week, so that's pretty exciting. Maybe we're in the same place. (laughs) That's gonna be incredible. (laughs) You've been many many places recently, but not here, so I can't wait to see you. I've been so Ex- many a little places. sneak peek <laughs> behind the curtain of what is what is to come. <laughs> I don't know. I, you too. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Just, I don't know. Great. I'm so happy. He's gonna come and hang out, and it's gonna be great. We're gonna drink and play video games. <laughs> Shocker! Yeah. Shocker! Yeah. We've never done that before. Never in our entire life. Wow, um, bonding. <laughs> we also, we also, and I'm not gonna give specifics, but we had a channel-based hiccup earlier today, so I'm all a bit <sighs> frazzled. <laughs> It happens. Yeah, but otherwise, it, um, <laughs> I had a I had a sneaking suspicion it was going to happen I, the in the moment when it was happening. This, I know <laughs> that's why I'm so upset because I knew better. I'm mad at myself. I knew better than to, <laughs> to risk it all. Um, yeah, we'll go double or nothing on a video bonus challenge, and we did, and we <laughs> lost it all. <laughs> we lost it all. Video we got never out of the cab. We never go double or nothing. <laughs> Actually, ever, I'll, ever. I'll just give the specifics. We took a break mid-recording, which is a bad idea. <laughs> like a long break. Yeah, like a we, long break, and like, uh, lost the whole video. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! Wait, I didn't even know this. Yeah, part. I only oh, found no. out earlier today. 
Uh, <laughs> it's yeah. okay. Oh, no. We we lost Gosh, a, a so massive. Sorry. We've lost a massive chunk of video video footage, but I think we're gonna be fine. So it's all okay. Yeah, it'll, it'll, okay. We'll, we will we will rebuild. We, we will recover. We have the technology. <laughs> we have the technology. Uh, it happens yeah. though, you know. Hopefully, it will be <laughs> as close to seamless as is humanly possible, given <laughs> that there will be weeks between recording sessions. Yeah, right. <laughs> It's a nice little reminder to like, if we're getting up, we need to click stop yeah, on the it, recording. It, it's, it's the basic nonsense. It's like, listen to the audio after you're done to make sure you actually recorded something. No, but look, we've all made that mistake. How many times? Like, no, this, you know, it, the, we've been doing this for over five years and I still don't learn. Yeah. Well, because you're always like, oh, we're only gonna, you know, hang out for five minutes. Yeah, it'll be and fine. Then, and then mid conversation and in your third drink, you're like, "Oh, wait a second, this we didn't hit stop. We didn't hit stop. Oh, is it still recording? <laughs> Fascinating. That's probably a three-hour video. <laughs> oh, this is a twenty-gig video, nothing, huh? Yeah, surely nothing would be wrong with a twenty-plus gig video. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> Only good things. Uh, anyway, point being, I'm doing yeah. well. <laughs> good. How are you, short? You know, are you good? I, I good. feel. I've, you know, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay, that's cool. I don't know, it feels like a weird time of year. Um, yeah, I, think, I feel that. You know, like the coming out of COVID thing is such a weird mentality. Um, no, yeah. But, yeah, yeah, I feel that immensely. So I feel like a little bit of a crazy wild boy who has no <laughs> place in life, but past that, I'm playing video games and having fun. Any uh, good video games? <laughs> I know we talked about one. I finished Nier, motherfuckers. Anyone yeah. want to talk about Nier? Anyone? No one in my life will play Nier. Anyone? <laughs> Anyone want to talk about Nier? Anyone? You shouldn't beat Nier. It's way too long for what it offers. <laughs> <laughs> and it makes you replay it literally five times, and it barely changes. But anyone play it? I beat it. I almost have an 100% completion on I it. I desperately want to talk to you about Nier, but that does require I actually play it. And every time I sit down in front of my PS5 to play Nier, I, I, I'll, I go for a walk. Or, or oh, something. Oh, you else. do something that's like you know beneficial and positive for you. Look, yeah, I great. beat the entirety of World's End Club instead of playing near, <laughs> and I don't know what to say about that. That's funny. Look, the game is the game is um fucking trash in so many ways, and it is also like a masterpiece, and it feels like a masterpiece despite the fact that it also feels like it was absolutely a game from 2008. For what it's yeah. worth, I, and, and short, <laughs> I do need to contextualize this. I've been dodging playing the original Nier for, for five Gina, years now. Gina, um, me because, too. Yeah, no, I, I have two copies that people have loaned me of the original Nier pre, like pre-remaster. Wait, of people wait, being, are you referring to the original Nier that you beat? Yeah, like, I'm referring that... to like Nier, Nier but I'm uh, I'm talking about Nier replicate version. Oh, the remaster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. 18, 12, you know, four, uh, 24601. Like yeah, that's I, the <laughs> whereas whereas I'm I'm referring to all of them like like both Nier original and Nier replicant because I do collectively have three copies sitting in my house of this game. <laughs> well, and I've played Nier... none of them. <laughs> Near Gestalt, which is original, don't play it. It's it's Papa Near. You don't need to spend time oh, with Papa him. Near. <laughs> Bro Brother Near's more fun, and he also plays a lot better. Uh, but he still makes you replay shit eighteen goddamn times. <laughs> You're playing the same section for like literally. There would be times where I'd find a podcast because I'm like, yep, well, I want to get ending. D and I have to replay four goddamn hours of the same unchanging material so I can see a maybe two minute long cutscene, but I can't get ending E without doing ending D. So here I am for four goddamn hours. I, I get it. Hell. I kind of did that with Rolls and Club by the end. I was like, oh, it's a platforming section. Time to turn on. <laughs> trying to turn Johnson my brain off. Or something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Go listen to some YouTube videos because I I don't want to focus on this right now. I get it. I get, honestly, it would it's good podcast time yeah. or good YouTube time. Yeah. Um. All being said, though, Near Replicant is like a wonder of a game, and like if you're in to Taro, uh, Taro, what's his name? What's his name? Uh, Taro. Tar what are you Taro. Yoko Taro. No. 
Yoko Taro. Yeah, 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 yeah. If you're into Yoko Taro's bullshit, like, <laughs> no, 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 it's, no, it's objectively but the bullshit. Is, like, I am, it's, <laughs> but I gotta play the game to get there. No, I know, I know, Gina, I'm with you. Like, I'm really into his bullshit, but the farther down I fall into the well, like, after I beat it, I proceeded to watch like 18 videos on Dragon Guard. Nice. Like like 49 ways in which like the one mobile game that had near DLC was like essential <laughs> for the plot. It's bullshit. Have, have it's you all followed bullshit. all the Final Fantasy 14 stuff? Yes. Yeah. yeah. All the yeah. Final Fantasy 14, all the gotcha games, the new game that just came out near reincarnation, yeah. which is literally a direct sequel to Automata, but it's a goddamn Japanese only gotcha game. And I want to <laughs> yell. I'm like, Yoko Taro. <laughs> Why do you behave this way? Why do you make me waste eight hours so I can get one fucking cutscene? But I'm also like, okay, daddy, I'll do whatever you want. Like, <laughs> like this work. I hate him, oh. and I clearly would like, like. Sure, you just I, made I, my week. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> God. <laughs> Wow. Uh, <laughs> what a goddamn anyway. gift. <laughs> anyway, go play Nier. More importantly, play Nier Automata. It's like the best game fucking ever. Yeah, it's pretty good. Nier I hate it, but it's pretty good. <laughs> oh my god. But I say I hate it with fun. love. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I feel very, strongly very, about it. <laughs> at the very least, Automata is fun. Replicant. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's fun sometimes, but not really. <laughs> No, I get that vibe, which is why every time I sit down to pick it up, I just don't. Um, I think I need to just play something else, it, like Ratchet and Clank, or oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Just so no, I, need, I need a palate a cleanser. One. Yeah. You know what I just bought today? What? Bug snacks. <laughs> you did oh, bug snacks. I've been wanting to play bug snacks since the day it came out. Bug I'm so blue. excited about bug snacks. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> that's good. Oh uh, no, I a bunch of people I know really, really liked Bug Snacks, so I hope you enjoy it. I, I want to play that the game you sent me. Short the um the uh the the opposite who done it game. Yeah, where you have to cool. murder your husband and get away with it. Yeah, and cover it up. Yeah. Oh, how cool does that sound? That sounds that, that sounds incredibly rad. <laughs> that actually sounds really rad. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's fun. <laughs> well, anyway, in all of that, do you <coughs> want to play whatever this game? What game are we playing today? I don't well, know. I'm so glad this you asked, cool. Short. Uh, today, <laughs> Disco Hips. <laughs> yeah, today we are playing Disco Elysium. But um, hey. whoa, 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 wiggle your Disco Hips. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad that that's the saying now. That's I'm glad. Thing I now. I did that. Wait, 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 <laughs> you wait, wait, did wait, that, Allison. Allison. And I, is this wait. gonna work? Oh, oh wiggle oh. your Disco Hips. So I, if, if there so was a piano what, there, we didn't hear it. Exactly. Whatever you tried no, to do, it didn't there work. was one. Oh, there was a whole we piano and everything. We heard you. I'm not good enough. <laughs> oh, this is good. I'm here for this. Should we do a summary of uh of last time? I think you we mean should, do should a Gina summary. do a summary of yeah. last time? <laughs> yeah. But, but, well, I was about to try, but then we wiggled our disco hips right on out of there. So. <laughs> Let me try. All right. Summary. Summary time. Rolling up my sleeves. Whew, okay. All, All right. right. So today we are playing Disco Elysium, a video game where you play as an Elysiac <laughs> detective trying to solve a murder. Um, it is Wednesday, the third day um, of this video game. Uh, and we've accomplished some stuff. I, I don't know how deep to get into it, but last time we unlocked a new area in the. Um, and I'm gonna open the map. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Whoa! Look at this. <laughs> um, wow. So for the first two days, we were confined to the Martinez waterfront, but we finally have access to the rest of our map, including a church, a fisherman shack, and a fast travel system, which is incredibly <laughs> important. Um. So. Uh, when we uh, advanced into this new area, we discovered that this sort of depiction of this um, boardwalk is a bit inaccurate. This is very much a crumbling um, imaginary area. This is what they wanted it to look like, but we got to see the reality of this um, part of town. Or and rather, I, 
Is this map just not really old? No, and, like, I think the area has been. I think it was a a projection wrecked. of what they wanted to build because there's no there's no Ferris wheel. Like some of the stuff is here, oh, like yeah. these little tents are here and stuff, but but like a lot of it seems like it just wasn't built. I was really looking forward to the egg. I, I mean, really wanted. We that. might. I know. We might egg. find the egg. We, we might, might find like. Egg. Yeah, we we didn't look for it properly. Okay. Um, so, but there's also, yes, uh, to your point, cool champion, there's also a big cube and we haven't seen that either. So, you know, um, yeah. anyway, um, as we we're exploring this area, uh, we came across, uh, a corpse. So we took on a second murder mystery or, or at least death mystery on top of our, uh, overarching plot that we're trying to solve. Mm -hmm. Um, and in addition to that, we got some, some information from a few of the, the sources that we had been working throughout this process. We talked to, um, Klausier. Is that, how, that her name? Clausier. 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 Uh, we talked with Clausier without our partner Kim around, and we were able to get some information. And then we talked to her again with Kim around to get more information. <laughs> because uh, we got intimidated. We, we did get a little intimidated. Um, we talked Multiple to levels. Martin Martinez um, and began internalizing <laughs> uh, the homosexual it agenda. Is so that that's how yeah. not his name um, for anyone who's keeping track. That is not actually his name. It is, as is Kurt Disco. <laughs> yeah, right. The story is what we write. Um, and we also discovered that uh, we, in our in some sort of drug or alcohol fr like crazed oh, yeah, episode. We had, honestly, my favorite scene in the game thus far. Where yeah. we, we sat oh, on with a Kim, um, yeah. yeah, we sat on a swing set with Kim and whistled and and just shared a moment as it slowly dawned on us that we are much more trouble than even we realized because that we, had we are... stolen a car and drove <laughs> it in uh, launched it over a ramp and driven it uh, driven it immediately into an ice shelf so well just know. truly that we are actual pieces of shit yeah we're like, yeah. We're, we're garbage and we are yeah, really that about us garbage. but we're we're yeah. just unpacking that slowly <laughs> we we have fallen long ago and we have been in the dirt for a bit, it seems. So, Heavy. yeah. Or, oh, wait, it was our, wasn't it our police car? I didn't think we had stolen it. It was probably it was our own car. Yeah. I think it was our own cop car. Which is even worse. Sorry, I'm... Into the wood. <laughs> Sorry, narrator, I was talking over you. <laughs> but I was like, it's okay, we're going to just ramp over it. I, I made the mistake fine. of clicking on it but while we were still talking. I keep That's forgetting okay. that it's not going to just sit there and that somebody's going to actually talk. Um, yeah, no worries. And there's also a slight delay, I, I know, for you, like mm -hmm. with me on Discord. So I, I probably end up sounding like I'm talking later than I actually am. <laughs> <laughs> also fair. My apologies. It's okay. Uh, <laughs> all right. Um, we can continue now, though. <laughs> real quick, repeating this: heavy door, uh, uh, heavy wooden doors, more than twice your height, stand shut in front of you. The rectangular, sea-worn ornamentation appears in stark contrast to the padlock carelessly drilled into the wood. Rattle the doors to see if they open. Inspect the carpentry. Take a closer look at the padlock. Inspect the staple. Leave. I might say look at the padlock. Yeah. This yeah. cheap looking padlock is sturdily built. It shackles together a hasp and a staple screwed into the wooden door. The lock is adorned with a yellow sticker. Look at the sticker. You see a yellow oh. circle with two X's and a big curve below them that looks like a mouth. You're pretty sure you haven't seen it before, but what the symbol depicts is clear enough. A smiling dead guy. The curve makes it smile and the X's make it dead. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> little like X's on his eyes. Yeah. Um, <laughs> have you seen the symbol before? Uh, yeah. He takes off his glasses and uses a blue handkerchief to thoroughly wipe them clean before inspecting the sticker. Then he looks up, pauses, and replies. No. <laughs> oh, what does it look looks like, like to you? A dead well, okay. <laughs> Suggests junior delinquency. Oh. Okay. Okay. What is junior delinquency? For yeah. Privacy, the moral intern defines junior delinquents as minors between the ages of 10 and 16 who have committed an act in violation of the law. God, thank you, Cam. These acts aren't called crimes as they would be for adults. Crimes committed by minors are called delinquent acts. This was part of your officer's exams. Wait, yeah. Look, you know we better. Would know, Don't judge but... us for that. What is suggestive of junior delinquency here? I haven't seen that sticker before. 
And I'm not a youth. You are not a youth. <laughs> I'm uh, not a youth. I'm going to try um, to remove the sticker. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's go for it. There's nothing like hey. the sound of a sticker on Billy. Now it's stuck to your thumb. Put the sticker in your ledger after the last entry where it belongs. Put the sticker on your ledger right over the cover. Uh, <laughs> take it off your thumb and throw it into the wind. Uh, put it where it belongs. Put it where it belongs. Looks yeah. like yeah. day was a gold star day. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Interface. <laughs> All interfacing. Aw, that's nice. Um, inspect, inspect the, the carpentry. The carpet sure. on the door is going to look like an angular, like the church itself. Two large beams shoot downwards, sinking into the wood before they reach the threshold. Run your hand over the beam, back up and look at the door. Run your hand over the beam? The surface mm. is smooth from the wind, but moist to the touch. Rattle mm. the doors. Nothing happens, only the sound of the padlock rattling against the door. I don't think that's going to work. Inspect the staple. The padlock passes yeah. through a staple that's been hastily mm. attached to the wood. Closer inspection reveals that one of the screws is not a screw at all. But a nail. The work has been done recently and is unprofessional, to say the least. Should you want to get through, it might be easier to just pry the whole thing off. This is where my pry Mr. Prybar comes in handy. Yay! Do we have a Mr. first and look for another way. The building has seen enough mistreatment. There is a touch what? of guilt in his voice. Where do you think we should start? We have a pry bar, but where do you think All we should right, start? Okay. Can you hear the pulsing bass underneath the wind? A sure sign of junior delinquency, somewhere east of here. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. So investigate further before before Just we start breaking Kim this happy. door down. We will do whatever it takes to make Kim happy. I I feel not bad about this at all. That is admittedly <laughs> my only goal in this game at the moment. Money was up there, and I I missed it. Oh, we gotta go get that money. Get though. those muns, huns. I will try. <laughs> I will try in the future. You said somewhere east of. Is there like a tunnel? Can you click? Can you go behind? Not this really. looks like a spooky house, it's like a, a haunted house. Yeah. Is there? Is there like a? It looks like there's a ladder on the side of it, but. It does not look like it's something we can get to. Um, uh, I guess. Yeah, we I guess can the give other... that a shot. It didn't. It doesn't highlight, so I don't know oh. if it's real. But oh, it, I meant it on the other side. Oh yeah, maybe that one. The, the... Yeah, but it doesn't. Is I that... just said it doesn't highlight. It's not, it's not real. It's not real. Okay. It sure looks real though. I know. Like... I'm pressing the highlight button right now though, so. That... Ah well. I guess we'll look on the other side. He said uh, east, yeah. so maybe there's like a tunnel. Maybe they meant weast. They probably meant weast. <laughs> like, uh, no, it's gonna take a moment to get there. That's fine. Uh, okay. <laughs> what is? Wait, wait, wait. Do you? You guys might not know, but what's the SpongeBob um, joke when he has the belt? Like, oh, 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 the Wumbo. Wumbo. I, like, <laughs> I Wumbo. It. You Wumbo. He, <laughs> she, she, it. Wumbo. <laughs> Wombology, <laughs> the study of Wombo. Come on, that's that's a good joke. That's a good joke. <laughs> that's a terrific goddamn joke. You know what? You know what? Short, your passion has convinced me. <laughs> There's Thank a you. lot Thank of Patrick Star passion. ones. The is mayonnaise an instrument? <laughs> Come on, a great joke. So good. <laughs> oh, it's a person. Early twenties. Kneels on the ice with an electronic contraption in her hand. Hearing you approach, she looks up. I really like her art. Oh, hello there. I want to know how to pronounce her name. It's cold out here, but she's not wearing a hat. Cell? She a must shell? be freezing. A shell? Like Everyone like knows a... drugs make you invulnerable to cold. You God damn it, electric chemistry. <laughs> Just quickly responding to the chat. We went, we went. <laughs> right first, and then I went left. <laughs> Thank you, but I did go right first. <laughs> we but not right enough. Yeah, I realized that, but we did go right first. <laughs> like, you can't... Nobody can say we didn't go right first. <laughs> Wowie. <laughs> yeah, okay, but we did go right first. <laughs> Is this the hill you're gonna die this on? This is it. 
<laughs> I shall complain about no other things. This is the one thing today. <laughs> and I've done it and it's over. Oh, <laughs> uh, dear child, it's freezing. Where is your hat? Huh? Oh, yeah. She looks up at you, distracted. I said you should have a hat on. Do you want my hat? Sasha it's gross. J. I have I ha we, I have we, a hat. I don't have anything to do. I am I have a hat. I should and I do. Point to your hat. I Number two. <laughs> yeah. oh. I didn't notice that. It's nice. You should wear one too if you plan on staying outside in this weather. Now that probably that's a good all idea. cleared up. I have, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do one. I like one, yeah. Yeah, well. Look, she man, tries to fuck think, the hat. Oh. But, oh. Look, I was going to okay. you a hat. We have extra what hats. did she just say? That's not how a <laughs> civilian is supposed to address an officer of the law. Is that good? language really oh necessary i like that option <laughs> i can come i can put my authority boots on and then come back put on your goddamn authority <laughs> I'm gonna, boots i'm gonna I'm put on my authority boots that. okay i was concentrating on something else my whole family swears and it rubbed off on me oh maybe i oh. don't maybe i don't oh. need my authority boots. that's a ignore authority <laughs> <laughs> maybe maybe it's a nice thing to to oh, i'm gonna okay. put on my authority but, boots give me a moment yeah but I, I think we need to put the authority boots on in order to progress get through this get out <laughs> of at least here she, even come close <laughs> at least she apologized yeah though. that's what i mean like i i feel like i don't need to dominate this child <laughs> <laughs> Um, do we have we have other authority things, don't we? I think I thought, I, I thought we did. We have a bunch of anti-authority. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I mean that is very us. <laughs> we have a drama. Um, <laughs> let's just change clothes in front of this child. One sec. Uh, all right, now that's it. That's Not the best we're gonna man? get. Hello again. All right. Oh wait, uh, how do I get wait. back? <laughs> oh shit! Can we not? What's your name? Sell. Yeah. Oh, shit. Your name? Why? I'm the police. Okay, it's Burger. Oh, oh shit. What? Is it a red check? Well, champ, you just told us red checks do not allow costume changes. Oh, oh well, we missed it. Okay. Oh, oh no! Oh. I, <laughs> look, we had to learn somehow. Dang. Yeah, <laughs> no, that's how we learned it. That's a lesson right there if I've ever She's seen one before. By this cop show questioning. Is uh, she? What's the device? This is a portable recording device. It's for field recording. Low quality, but still. And the wires? Actually, just one wire. I picked on it till the braiding came loose. The wire leads to a contact microphone. What's a contact, contact microphone? Contact mic records yeah. sounds from inside things, like this ice. Your mangled brain would like you to know there is a boxer called Contact Mike. Encyclopedia, how did Thanks, that contribute to the conversation? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, any news on my wife's name? How about my mother? <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> Or what am I supposed to do with this? Those are both very good. <laughs> I like the top one. I, I like yeah. the idea of just giving Encyclopedia sass. I feel like they deserve it. No. <laughs> okay, come on, Encyclopedia. You're welcome. <laughs> <Did> you... <laughs> Does this good. have anything to do with contact, Mike? <laughs> How much do you think Kim would disapprove is the question that I have. <sighs> Less than we probably expect him to. <laughs> yeah, yeah, honestly. Yeah, I record stuff with it. No, I mean the boxer. Oh, uh, no. This is a contact microphone. It's for recording inside solid objects. Contact mic just beats people up. That's not fair. <laughs> and an understatement. You know contact mic doesn't just beat people up. Contact mic is a role model. Is he? Is contact mic like Mr. T? Because that's the, the or <laughs> that's what I'm getting here. I love Imagine. I was not thinking Mr. T, but now I love thinking Mr. T. Um, can I ask you a question? What? Okay, wait. She's talking. What did What did Mr. T do? <laughs> I, I know what Mr. T looks like, but but he's kind of like a Chuck Norris. Like I'm not really sure what he did. I mean, to he be was Mr. T. He was uh, an actor and known on uh, the television show The A Team, and oh, he was also in Rocky Three. Yeah, he's the A-team guy, oh, A and he guy. was the, the the boxer in Rocky Three. Wow, okay. And for anyone who's older than me in this chat and is mad about that, I am but we child. And I'm oh, no, no, sure. <laughs> I didn't know either. <laughs> okay, <sweet. laughs> 
<laughs> it's all good. I was like, I really hope Allison has an answer to this. <laughs> Allison, you really pulled through there. <laughs> Thank you. You had the info I wanted to know. <laughs> I'm glad I can provide. <laughs> Very much appreciated. I was like, I'm just going to sit here quiet and hope this resolves itself. <laughs> just hope that somebody resolves it. <laughs> um, our responses right now are... Inspector Clark was right. He pitied the fool. <laughs> he, uh, he did. Um, <laughs> Thank you, Clark. It. <laughs> um, all right. Well, our responses here are, yes, you heard right. You should try to be more like Contact Mike, a successful as uh, athlete and an inspirational figure who has overcome social, physical, and mental obstacles. On second thought, screw Contact Mike. He's not a champion. You are. Look at uh, look at you here in front of a saggy tent, picking your nose to drum, uh, picking your nose to drum <laughs> attic music. The world of sports is in awe of your faith and dedication. <laughs> and sorry. I don't know why I said that. There was something else I wanted to know. <laughs> <laughs> There's something great between number one and number three. I agree with that. I kind of like number three, honestly. <laughs> you don't want to fall down this... Look, last time we fell down a massive rabbit hole, we may have accidentally solved a, a murder mystery. So honestly, you no, never know. Good, You're right. Good I point. I fall down the rabbit hole. Well, it. number one. Let's do Man, it. Man, you are one weird cop. This isn't about me. This is about your lack of respect for one of boxing's greats <laughs> and for yourself. I'd say I'm just about normal now that Mike, not Mike, Mike. <laughs> you and this Mike guy. The question is rhetorical. Okay. <laughs> if it floats your boat, I'll be more like contact Mike. I got a like thought. <laughs> we, we, <laughs> yeah. We got, we got Hell yeah, we got a thought. of contact Mike. Amazing. <laughs> yeah. All right. Sure. Um, uh, okay, yes, uh, that does float my boat. Thank you. Self-respect is not meant to float anyone's boat, but your own. I love that. <laughs> Actually, that's great. Mind for future use. Okay. I think, uh, she's, I think she's lying to us. I think she might be lying to us. Uh, probably. Uh, I really want to know no, what she's I, doing. I don't exactly know. Somehow it doesn't pick up vibrations from the air. The book said it only picks up structure-born sound, if you like technobabble. Where'd you get it? Same place I got the recorder from. The Palisseum. What's the Palisseum? Oh, man. Ooh. You haven't been to the Palisseum? It's the coolest place in this whole drug-addled shithole. I it's hope it's a cube! Club and a synthesizer workshop on Boogie Street in Jamrock. Musicians live there, like real musicians. I once saw Arno Van Eyck. Thinking about it really cheers her up. It's a long way from here, though. Sounds interesting. Hmm. Who's this Arno guy? And sounds yeah. like a place for congregating homosexuals. You will see well, us there. Us. <laughs> <laughs> if I say, yeah. is it going to be homophobic or is it going to be a, oh, wait, that's me. <laughs> I want it to be a, oh, wait, that's me, but I think it might be the former, but I'm not tell. sure. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> I, 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 it's weird because we haven't actually processed the thought that we made. Yeah, that's yet. true. We're still thinking about it. We're still thinking about it. We're still trying to work shit out right now. Like, <laughs> if it's not underground, though, it's a good point. Then right. maybe we don't. It's too mainstream. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Guess you wouldn't know Van Eyck. Or really be a Palisium going kind of person. I get down. I. I don't know what that means. I grind. I don't know what that means either. I party. <laughs> it means I'm hip by, beyond my years. Wiggle your disco hips. Yes. <laughs> oh, wiggle your disco hips. <laughs> Nor do I. But wiggle I'm... your disco hips. <laughs> you get it? I made it major. Uh, <laughs> that was good. It was great. It was very positive and upbeat. Oh. <laughs> Oh, nor my do God. I have con uh, nor do I, but I have concrete evidence that I rock in the form of a wrecked tape player in a completely trashed hostel room, and that's what I actually <laughs> I have no idea what I'm trying and talking about. Get down, Get down grind. grind. <laughs> Sorry, I had to say it with you. That was really funny. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of like uh, to <laughs> again committing to the bit. But I is think this also one or is two this superstar enough? <laughs> Uh, true. Fair. Maybe number we one. Are cosplaying a superstar, so that's true. <clears throat> I that's said cool. cosplaying, not role playing, but it made me smile. 
<laughs> you know, it feels more accurate somehow. <laughs> um, She's like, we're that's LARPing cool. a, a superstar, and that's what matters. You're right, time has deserted me. Never mind, let's talk about contact Mike. This, that contact Mike instead. Uh, uh, uh. I don't want to say time deserted. <laughs> I kind of want to just do number two. <laughs> or do we want to admit that we're not cool? We can't admit that. No, we can't admit that. We can't admit it. We can't admit it. So it's got to be number two. All right. Actually, I had what? some non-mic questions. Okay. No, but I want to know. Okay, what are you doing out here? Thank you. Okay, that's fine. Recording, I guess. <laughs> and what are you I recording? I think I'm recording cracks in the ice, but there's no way to tell. Not without headphones. I think I just recorded your footsteps too. Not sure how that will sound. What happened to your headphones? My boyfriend yeah. sold them. Well, that sucks. Aww. I don't know, man. Well, what? Things. That is just stuff just for the life. worst. <laughs> A lie. They That's were rude. probably pawned off for something suspicious. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, drama. And what are these recordings for? The cracks, the footsteps. The musicians in the Palisseum used them for making music. That's cool. They oh. looped the stuff, cutting the tapes together. They make music out of cracks in the ice and keys jangling. Crazy sounds like that. It's hard to explain. She's anyway, making samples. Cool. Mm -hmm. I thought yeah. I'd make some too. It's supposed to be like a music place anyway. She rubs her shoulders and looks around. I don't really know what I'm doing. They use synthesizers too. I don't have a synthesizer. Can we change our entire goal and instead fund this this child's quest for <laughs> musical, musical greatness? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Honestly, who needs to solve the murder of a dead body when someone over here needs MIDI? I certainly right? don't need <laughs> yeah, to solve right. it. Like, I feel like it's gonna be solved whether or not we're involved. <laughs> Although we have been doing pretty good detective work lately, so. She looks we are, yeah. we are a good detective. The things she thought would fill her hours with joy and escape. It's turning out to be an empty fantasy. She feels childish. Very useless all of a sudden. No! This is oh, our no, new, this you're is doing it. Great we shit. found our new entire goal in this video game. This can is I, it. Can I? Yeah. Can I just say from her like a little sprite in game right here, not her portrait, she kinda looks like Chie from Persona 4. Oh, she right does. Now. She totally does. And it's, it's really getting me. It really does. Let's buy yeah. her some kung fu movies and steak. Yes. Hey, get her steak. steak. Oh my god. That actually makes me smile. <laughs> That's um, all I can As opposed see. to this this devastating paragraph empathy just fed us. I oh, hate it very geez. much. <laughs> it's very Denise, sad. You're cold. Lieutenant ta begins to take off his jacket. No, ma'am, oh. fuck that. I'm cold. I'm sorry I said that. I'm sorry about the fuck. It's okay. No. Lieutenant um, it's backs okay. up. He throws you a glance. Now this is where a hat would come in handy. Give her your hat. Here, you need this more than I do. You said it's supposed to be music place. What is? I'm going to give her, her our hat. Okay, are we good to relinquish that hat yeah. and the stats it gives us? Yeah, we have we have some other dumb hats that we can wear. All right, this is let's do this. it. Look, this is my new goal. <laughs> this is, yeah, this give her. Is it. Thanks. Fuck yeah, give her the hat. Yeah. Oh, yay! All right. You said it's oh. supposed to be a music place. What is that? Mm -hmm. The boys think it could be a place like the Palisseum or something. Oh, stupid! It's really not going to be a Palisseum, that's for sure. The boys? Yeah. Andre and the guys, they're inside, in the tent. Oh. I mean, there's Wait. A, in Atlanta, there's a major music venue, which used to be a, a church called the Tabernacle. So it can it's be done. the best. It is literally the best. The entire backdrop is like this gigantic church organ. And it's sick as fuck. <clears throat> it's really, I, I'm, a, I'm a big oh, fan that's of so that cool. venue. I, it's just so much fun. I watched Brendan Yuri do a backflip off of that pipe organ. And I was like, this, is, this is a good day right now. I also independently saw Brendan Yuri in that venue, so you know, it's it's just where he's most at home. <laughs> it's where he does backflips, apparently. Yeah. He always does backflips. He can do like one kind of backflip, and he really likes to show it off. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, Brendan, you're off. Okay, okay, Brendan, I get it. You're hot as hell and the best singer alive, and you can backflip. <laughs> you can do backflips. Okay. <laughs> I mean, if you got it, flaunt it, I guess. Yeah. So. <laughs> if you got it, he's, he's got a lot of it. things. And the question is, is a backflip enough of one for him to be flaunting it? <laughs> it's I definitely mean, enough for some people. He lands <laughs> it most of the time. <laughs> Oh man, can you imagine being at the show where he doesn't land it and you're like, not only did I see the signature Brendan Urie backflip, but he also didn't stick the landing. That would really, <laughs> I gotta be honest, that would really do it for me. Like, that would be, <laughs> I'd go home a happy boy no matter what that night because I'm like, that feels special. I mean, sure, were like, you with me at the Tabernacle when we saw Fall Out Boy and they had to shut down, like, they had to stop ooh, the concert yeah, because yeah, somebody, the was, yeah, they're being weighed. In. Yeah. What? Yeah. Wait, what? Oh yeah, that's a real thing. The floor caved in on this like weird rundown church that like Brendan Yuri and like Father John Misty and Marshmallow all performed at. Like it was the <laughs> weird, I'm serious, the weird, I went to an EDM fest there. I saw Nickel Creek there who are a bluegrass <laughs> band. Like that venue is so weird. Whoa! Yeah, it, it is. It is an eventful venue, to say the very least. Um, yeah, that's wild. Yeah. <laughs> this has been a great. <laughs> this has been our music corner. <laughs> yeah, so side being, corner. They should do it. They should make the church into a venue, but also they should reinforce the floor because. <laughs> <laughs> that's, what right. we, that's what we've learned. <laughs> Wait, Clark. Clark, that was an entire. Um, run that they did for like two years. It was like Fall Out Boy, Panic, Weezer, and 21 Pilots before 21 Pilots. Was this separate from the, um, the, yeah. the Fueled by Ramen run? Yeah, the Fueled by Ramen run was a different thing. That was but pretty the, early. But all of when, those like, were together in that run as well because I saw that. That's oh, when really? I saw them for the first time. And then later, Weezer yeah. Weezer Fueled by Ramen? Uh, maybe not, but the others were. Okay. All right, mm -hmm. cool. Anyway. Yeah. Anyway. Anyways. Sorry. Any hoozles? Any hoozles? Amazing. <laughs> Why are you freezing out here when the boys are inside? They got too much stuff crammed in there. No room. Stuff like what? Music stuff, mostly. Like this tape recorder, but bigger. And there's piles of it. You mean like those headphones your boyfriend sold? Yep. Yeah. They were pretty. I'm sorry we sold those. Why not just leave someone, uh, some of it outside so you don't have to freeze? That stuff is more expensive than I am. More expensive than any of us, really. Doesn't matter. I can take the cold. You said it's supposed to be a music place. What is? That? Yeah. Oh, no. We already boy, we did yeah. this. Sorry. And oh, yeah, yeah. That. She Got looks it. back at her. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, da, 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 empathy. Legendary. Ooh, we have a pretty good chance at this. Oh, the tape we recorder do, we lies do. in the ice like a discarded toy. Pick it up. Oh. We're just gonna... We're gonna... We gave her the hat, and... She's more like contact Michael. Yeah, do it, do it, do it. Yes, 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 yes. The device is still. Yeah. Oh, we just squeaked we by, huh? <laughs> we did just design. squeak by. The company logo, Omicron, adorns its yellow plastic cover. Inside, the tape is rolling. The girl looks at the device in your hands. I'm sorry you have to sit here on the ice feeling miserable. At your age or at any age in this weather, waiting for it to get dark. Yeah, I'm going to say that. Mm. She looks you in the eye. Her pupils wide, surrounded by a ridiculous amount of makeup. The people who built this world intended it to be better for you, but they failed. It is easier to live in their failure with this by your side. Tap onto the rate, uh, tape recorder. Uh, do you want me to just, I'm just going to- Yeah, look, yeah, look, just clearly, do it. Look, Kurt yeah. has something that Kurt wants to say, and I don't know if I realized what it was going to be, but he's saying it, and- I didn't either, and I want to let him say the thing, yeah. so- You go, you go do your thing, Kurt. Me. The wind howls. She remains silent. It's yeah. real. Tell her. It's not a childish fantasy. It can be a real weapon against what's coming for you. What is? Her shoulders shake a little. The dark. Nothing if you got this. Don't be scared. I'm once again reminded of how Contact Mike rose up from the slums of St. Louis <laughs> to, top of, to the top of the boxing world, overcoming adversity and serious brain trauma. Nothing is coming. Nothing he wouldn't knock out in three rounds. The real fight is for the right attitude. I mean, we could say three because we, we did have her yeah. internalized Contact Mike, but I've also... Uh, 
look, we've already been weird with this. <laughs> we've already That's been true. Weird. I yeah, let's do it. that. Let's rule do it. That if we've been a weirdo once, we're like, all right, you're getting all of me. <laughs> you're getting all the weird. <laughs> I mean, do you want me to say nothing? If you got this, don't be scared. No, be weird. No, be those, weird. those other two are lame. So <laughs> I can't believe this turned into another mic thing. Fine. Okay, I'll stick to it. She takes. I'll knock it out in three rounds. Yeah. Yeah. Contact Mike. Yes. There's you can do to help her now. But given the chance, you feel like you should. There is something about her. A weightiness. Something changes between you two. She looks at you differently now. As an equal. Oh. A fellow human being. No this way nice. our weirdness works. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it works. I just want you to know that I've had my fist in the air like for Judd Nelson session. for 30 seconds Maybe now. Yeah. <laughs> What's been eating you, officer? I can't, I can't believe <laughs> That's so funny. She says, so thanks, I guess, for the psych session. <laughs> Maybe I can return it. <laughs> What's been eating you, officer? <laughs> What's been eating you, Gilbert? Are we about Great. to unpack our, our nonsense? Wait, yes. I say we be as transparent. We choose her. She's going to be our, our second Kim, yep. as transparent as possible. <laughs> You're Kim number two as well. Wild. I've got great news. Come on, I can tell. But, okay. Be a boy or dare about it if you want to. I guess there is something that's making my life hell. <laughs> exactly. Yes, I don't want to talk yeah. about it. Let's open Wait, up. Uh, it. Yes. I think it's the plight of the working class. <laughs> <laughs> we could be communists. <laughs> Everyone's just mooching off the entrepreneurial class, shackling the doers. Uh, I think it's all these foreign people taking our job. God damn. And people We've... just keep putting their selfish interests ahead of the greater good. I think let's do that one. <laughs> Number four? Cause that's yeah, because it's like, oh, it's like, to te you can, you, uh, it's, you know, <laughs> it's like a little, <laughs> you can, like, put up the socialist gauze on it, but, like, it's not weird. Like, <laughs> yeah, I guess no. <laughs> you did, is I guess this one too weird? Number one. Think of the plan before. I just love, I just love that after all this nonsense, this girl's like, What's eat, eating you? And you're like, you know, thank you so much for asking. It's the, it's the plight of the working class. The plight of the working class is really uh, making me act weird lately. <laughs> it's really been eating me up. Oh, my God. All right. Oh, my I'll God. I guess number four. Yeah. Oh, uh, really? <laughs> yeah, no one understands that sometimes you gotta make sacrifices for the sake of progress. It's all very distressing. I don't- I don't like this one. <laughs> yeah. I liked- I, I liked the plight of the working class. I think we should have stuck to our guns and went with the plight of the oh, working class. God. <laughs> because we're communists. So, the thing that's been eating you is the slow pace of social progress. <laughs> okay, that's true, though. You know, don't get me wrong. I'm all for slow and steady progress. I just wish people would be a little more reasonable is all. And no, that's probably not it, is it? And yeah, pretty sure. Now I have some questions about something else in time. <laughs> <laughs> Oops, I didn't mean to go off on this tangent. Let's move along. No, um, we should go farther. Say, um, if I say, say number two. Okay. And see if we find no, like the right. It thing. sounds like you just got chick issues. <laughs> that could you could be right. It's but I very don't know insightful. Well, think about anyway. Was there something else? Um, Tell me about this music place. It's supposed yeah, to become like a club for anodic dance music, like that new style of synthesizer stuff they play at the Palisium. Except that, yeah. She looks at the old wooden church um, up on the hmm. up on the poles as a mean wind comes bellowing in, and the six-story structure lets out a doleful shriek. What? What? Oh. What's? What's that? You know, anodic, yeah. cathodic, music that's made with electronic instruments. Electronic instruments? Like what? Synthesizers yeah. I hate electronic and instruments consoles. around here. Microcomputers too. Anything that uses electricity, but isn't guitars. Also, found sounds, stuff like that. You see clear, beautiful, violent flashes of light. Light cutting through a smoke-filled darkness. That is what the future will look like. If it ever comes. So, not something we can play at karaoke, is what you're saying. <laughs> no. Probably not. No, um, this is like a knife party, you know? <laughs> Do you want to turn the church into a club? I know. 
It's not my Allison, do you know Knife Party? Andre and the Boys. Knife Party? Place. No. It was supposed to be oh, deserted, man. but now they can't even take it. <laughs> I love Hold on, I'm looking them up I'm right sorry. now. I'm sorry, I just love how your aw man like faded into the background. <laughs> oh, <laughs> like man. you were leaning got... way away from the mic and just like <laughs> feeling. <laughs> I got nervous because she was still talking, but uh, it, you got to look up Centipede by Knife Party. That song goes fuck shit. That song goes crazy. <laughs> <laughs> that song goes fuck <laughs> shit. <laughs> <clears throat> no, we're the police. Yes, why we do you ask? Police. I don't know where you got that. I yes, why do you ask? Okay, well, maybe you could talk to Andre and the guys, because there are some strange things going on in that church. If you're police, you should look into it, right? I'll talk with them. Oh, yeah. Uh, inside yeah. That thing there would be cool if you did. Okay. Was there something else? Did you put the padlock on the church no. door? No. Not mm. really. Yeah. She's trying to get out of a direct lie with <laughs> Not really. She personally didn't put the padlock on the door. Okay, if you personally didn't, then who did? <laughs> Show yeah. her the sticker. Show her the sticker so this isn't yours. It's Noid. Yeah, do that. It's Noid's. We got a Wait. name. Yeah. Is Noid? Noid a friend of yours? Yeah, I guess you could say that. Why did this Noid person put the padlock on the church door? To keep yeah. more weirdos from getting in. Fucking Martinez. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's got the worst weirdos. If you get around to it, ask Andre about him. He'll tell you. All right. Cool. Go ahead. Okay. Um, da, 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 da. He seems surprisingly comfortable about being questioned. Uh, well, it's just you know? questioning, right? You're just questioning me. It's what cops do. Fast and clean. A good one. Can't quite say it's a lie, but it feels like one. She's better at lying. That she'd like everyone to know. Ooh, drama coming Whoa, in with a challenging hey, success. Drama. I don't know oh. to whether to trust you, drama, because you do lie. But um, yeah, um, have you, you been questioned before? Twice, yeah. I'm sorry, I haven't had the river show experience. They get east of the river. Mm, interesting. What's mm. east of the river? Rich people. Yeah. Rich people are east of the river. Look awestruck. Who are these rich people? They sound wonderful. I'd like to be one too. <laughs> um, sneer. I bet they're really rich. They must be very special people to be so rich. Lean in and whisper, let me guess, these rich people are not from around here. And strange, cool. the existence of rich people does not stir any emotion in me. <laughs> uh, I guess do we want to lean into the, the communism and go with two? <laughs> or no? <laughs> I thought that was a bad communist. I also can't interpret. I, I don't know how to interpret him sometimes. Like, I think this is being racist. I think yeah. this is being. I, I know. <laughs> I think this is an ugh, rich people, but it's like they must be very special people to be so rich. Yeah, it's like an underhanded compliment. Like,. I just don't want to be ap accidentally, pr whatever, I'm going to say I mean, it. you could just say, oh, okay, good to know, and then we <laughs> yeah. just move on. Okay, good to know. Uh. <laughs> I mean. They are, and I'm scum. I'm scum, too. No, you're not scum. You're not scum. You're, not scum. you're, you're a nice lady. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you're nice. You're not scum. Oh, but I am. Yeah, I, I was like, I have a feeling that's not going to resonate the way you think it's going to. Oh, um, okay. So what trouble have you gotten into with the, the usual. police? I had a shitty run as a teenager. What's the usual? You know, drinking, getting into fights. The ugly stuff that happens when you move out your parents' place at 13. In Forberg. Wait, what is in Foberg? Is this a rhetorical question? No, I literally can't remember even the most basic words. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> <clears throat> Foberg, not in Foberg. <laughs> It's a massive bonnet. Oh, is he not reading the line? <laughs> it is the largest ghetto in Revachon. Oh, there he goes. Possibly the world. I know what Jamrock is, but let's say I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, like that there was such a long pause. <laughs> so so I was just like. Mm. Uh, Why did um, you have to move out when you were so young? I guess this is. Yeah, the that point. one. We do know yeah. what Jamrock is. My dad yeah, was we do. Drunk. Plus, I guess I just wanted to drink too, you know, get my party on. You know what? I think you've really learned something from all those times that you've been questioned. Some of your lies have been pretty good. Um, I get that. I'm a major party animal myself. Major. And drinking, partying, and disco music are bad for you. I, we're, let's say one. 
Yeah, since um, we already set that thank up. Thank you. Oh, okay. The girl is truly experience. proud of herself. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I can't even remember how many times you've told, uh, how many you've told or which ones I picked up on. Now another question. Lying to the police is nothing to be proud of. I'm going to say the top one. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Okay. All right. I think we're done. Right. Okay. That All sounds right. good. Do we want to go into they're the in tent? The t yeah, they're in the tent here. Yeah. Because we eventually, because we want to get into that. Why do we want to get in that church? Is you want to get in that church? I don't know. Covering a I don't know. Maybe it's just a side the thing. Let's just do it. Open. I think we were Inside, just interested. Three yeah. young men are listening to some new form of music. It's like nothing you've ever heard. One of them looks at you. I mean, literally, the reason we were at the church is because it was a fast travel point. We wanted to be able to jump over to the east side to, to Martin's. Oh, yeah. But, mm. Uh, mm. but mm -hmm. it's where we are now. And let's go. There's, Come on. Yeah, there's clearly Dina stuff here. Behind you. The warm stuff's getting out. It's safe to assume this is their leader. Or at least he thinks he is. Squeeze in. Sorry, you barely have room for one. You go ahead. Oh. I'm too old for this. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Sorry to drag you so on this are we, Kim. I'm actually not, he thinks. I just dislike delinquents. Okay. I'm sure <laughs> okay. you will feel right at home. I keep okay. Watch. Are you calling as a delinquent, Kim? <laughs> You're Aww. mean, Kim. That was very sweet. <laughs> All right, here we go. <laughs> oh, we, we're in. I'm in. <laughs> he hacked into the tent. <laughs> oh! Okay. This is, okay. Sure. Hey, I gotta, I gotta put my this? other headphone in so Wait, I can yeah, hear can their you music. Turn up, can you turn up this banger for a second? I, I literally don't think I can, but, oh wait, no, right. our music is down. Wait a sec, here we go. Hell yeah, turn up the banger. I think it made no difference. Oh, there it goes. Yeah! All right, like, sure. Yeah, you know, like, it's not offensive. If it was ambient music at a club, I'd be like, all right. Yeah, I've <laughs> like, heard worse. <laughs> I've heard see, better, though. <laughs> like, reaching the tips of his hair with a toothbrush. He puts the toothbrush down and extends his hand in greeting. Hello, I'm Andre. It's a pleasure to meet you. Shake his hand. His grip is strong, sweaty, and warm. He's trying to project and inspire confidence. This is my posse, Noid. The young man with earrings posse. looks at you suspiciously. I like your necklace, Noid. <laughs> I like his pompadour hair. It's a and pompadour mullet. hair and mullet. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> That's mullet back there. <laughs> yeah, there's a party in the back. <laughs> and egghead. Egghead. Oh, egg! We found our people! Egg! We egg. wanted an egg! That's all you said, egghead! You are our people! Welcome! <laughs> Together with this little burger, who's out there right now, doing some seriously progressive sonic experimentation, we like to think of ourselves as music venue organizers. Wait, how many music venues have you organized? We have met yeah. in the pipeline, officer. Okay, why are you You see, here? we've been all over Jamrock North, prospecting for real estate to establish a new venue in. Honest off for talent. <laughs> egg. Egghead, yeah, egg I really head. wanted you to only say the words egg. I realize that that's not egg. realistic and it's not in tone of this game, but I did no. want you to only say the words egg. Also, you've got some serious soulless energy in your, um, your... <laughs> The the like the way the art is lit up behind him does make it look like he's an elf yep. right now. Oh, completely. He's got like I don't entirely know what it's supposed to be other than basically soulless <laughs> lit by the maker's light. Much Fuck that chagr egg. Uh, chagrin. Um, yeah. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> and while there is no shortage of raw, unfettered talent spinning tapes in Jamrock, we've had rotten luck with the real estate part. Place is a shithole. I apologize for my friend Noid's potty mouth. I realize this is not how you speak to a police Potty officer. mouth? I he like has these guys. Andre! <laughs> <laughs> oh. I like... There... <laughs> There's no oh need. The God. place is pretty bad. Next time, watch yourself. Was there something you wanted? Your friend Asel said there was a problem with the church. Might as well just jump to it. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. I, I kind of wish we could be like... Uh, thank you for apologizing for your potty, ma potty mouth. It really offended me. <laughs> like, <laughs> I think that's the next time watch yourself option, but it doesn't give off the same feeling. 
Yeah, I agree. I would just go with three. <laughs> ah, so you've met her. Good, good. Yeah, it's a matter of occupied ecclesiastical property. I bet you've noticed the derelict hive of Narcomania on the coast. An I love this dude. To <laughs> perceived conservative sensibilities. No person his age would ever use a word like Narcomania with a straight face. Don't fall for it. Enough histrionics. What are you talking about? I'm talking about the <laughs> church, and I'm not exaggerating. Even a place of spiritual refuge can become a magnet for all sorts of dope heads and burnouts if left unattended. Dope heads! Okay, I get <laughs> Thanks, I get <laughs> Okay, well, Noid. <laughs> sad to say, that's exactly what happened. Sad because we were just about to put Martin A's on the map with one of the maddest dance clubs in Jamrock. Nah, strike that in Revershol. Strike that! The world. And so, yeah, Hell yeah! Go <laughs> off, head. Head. Up, you know, the worst kind. He leans back a little, watching you with a steady, serious gaze, letting you imagine just how bad those dope heads and burnouts really are. Good. This calls for an opinion. You're an expert in those. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> rhetoric. <laughs> <laughs> that okay. felt a little insulting. A little it, it was only an a easy little rhetoric bit. win, so um, I won't stand oh. for narcomaniacs of any kind. No narcomaniacs on my watch. Shake your head gravely. I feel like you may be laying this on a bit thick. What's really so bad about these dope heads and burnouts? I mean, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. We'll, we'll do that. <laughs> We're, we, I don't know. <laughs> electrochemistry would have us say that we disagree with number one very strongly. <laughs> that is That's true. true. That is very so, true. I'm go with two. It's okay. my first time listening to electrochemistry, but I'm going to do it. <laughs> Finally, electrochemistry gets their moment. <laughs> and it's what here exactly? with a bunch of children. Um, what exactly do you mean by spooky? Spookiness is not a matter for police investigation. What do you mean by spooky? I was hoping you would be the judge of that, officer. All I can say is, their spookiness is the kind that keeps us from restoring this church into a community centre and a place of They're spiritual spooky. refuge. Also, <laughs> they don't eat or clean the building. Shit's gonna collapse. People just want to spin tapes without them spooking it up. Place has bad signs. No one can dance like that. Thank you, Egghead. So you're gonna look into it, right? It should be a police matter. Getting them out. Whatever spooky stuff they're doing, I'm sure it's not what the Ecclesiastes meant their property for. I'll look into it, tell me more, get the task. <laughs> this is wild. <laughs> this is not why we came in here, but that's okay. I'll make up my mind later. I have questions for I'm you really first. I'm really distracted, but I love this. I, I'm um, gonna take the task. I see no reason yeah, not to take do the it. task. Right, at the end of this game, is gonna calculate all the tasks we picked up and didn't do, and it's gonna judge us for it. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be really <laughs> mad about a lot of them. Andre's obviously uh. very happy you took him seriously. The whole tent is. The boys exchanged giddy looks. Still told me Noid uh, put the padlock on the door. Why? Yeah, let's start there. Yeah, I'll do that. I did ask Noid to install a measure against more drifters wandering in. It's a temporary fix, just something to contain the situation. I had to do it in an hurry. Not my best work. I need the key. But it should hold for a while. I need the key. How long have those people been locked in there? Locked in the. Oh, shit. I need the key. Of course. Noid, give the officer yeah. the key. All Thank right. you. Okay. Well, the speed well. dips into his belt pack and produces a yellow key. He then makes a sudden cool infused move, tossing it in your general direction. Reaction speed, be the cool <laughs> cop. Catch the it's, key as it flies. Oh, it's a red check, you. but we gotta try it. Let's do it. We gotta, gotta give it a shot. 42 seconds. Oh. Oh. You think you can Tragic. sense the key moving in the air? Yeah. I feel like this we're is always not a cool cop. Cool. <laughs> Don't ruin the cool by overdoing it. Raise your hand in front of your face with minimum effort. Blam. Straight in the eye. Straight oh, jeez. In the looking ball. That's a shame. A that sucks. Pain. Tears stream uncontrollably from your right eye. What? <laughs> Ouch, goddamn asshole. What is wrong <laughs> with you? Can't you see I'm uh, in pain uh, now? I'm super sorry. That was totally my bad. I got overexcited. He looks like he's genuinely sorry. He didn't oh. throw that I'm sorry. Wait, I'm sorry. I kind of like these kids. Yeah, I know. Dude, they're fun. <laughs> they just seem like kids. Like, 
Um, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You almost, I murdered me. A cop! That use of, that's use of lethal force this is my only option. I don't like where this I'm is really going. I'm sorry, man. Just take this, okay? He pulls out some black paper from his belt pack. Well, looks like there's quite a lot there. Uh, that's the least you could do. Take the money. Oh. No. Take the money. No, 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 no. Put your morals away. Take the money. Are you kidding? <laughs> do we want to have the bribe? goddamn money? Are yes. we a bribed cop? Yes, yes. Especially in a low stake situation like this, where it literally doesn't matter. <laughs> you uh -uh. You make We've been bribed money. in much scarier situations, and guess what we did? We took it. Take it. Oh, <laughs> all right, all right. Twenty-five real. Wait. That's such good Whoa! money, baby. That's good money. Holy yeah. hell yeah. <laughs> Thank you, child. Steal from the children. Steal from Steal the children. From the children. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, we have to say that differently because the only other people we've approved of stealing from are the racists. Oh, no, you're right. You're right. Don't, I don't steal want... from children. <laughs> But do don't take your bribes. bribes. Don't steal from don't children. Steal from but children. do take but the do bribes. Take <laughs> do what the game railroad has been doing because of a failure. Oh no, no. <laughs> didn't have a choice. <laughs> I feel bad since our goal is to help them open this music venue and we're just taking their cash. <laughs> we just took their money. Yeah, oh my God. boy. Well, that's fine. We were talking about the padlock, I think. How long have those people been locked in there? Not long. Like a week, maybe? A oh, time. there's people watching this! <laughs> it's a long time. Oh, no. I'm gonna sure they haven't starved to death. I'm super sure they're alive. I mean, come on. I'm at least 90%, maybe 85% sure they're oh, still alive. Oh, maybe these kids aren't that good. Somewhere uh -oh. in the ruinous past that led you here, there was something called exams. You may have learned the term involuntary manslaughter. <laughs> Andre, oh. do you know what involuntary manslaughter means? 85% <laughs> is not good enough when you're dealing with another person's physical well-being. 85% is good enough. No one lives forever, baby. Um, <laughs> I like one or two. <laughs> yes, I do. I listen to Channel 8 all the time. I know about crime stuff, and I assure you, officer, this is not what's happening here. I'm at least 80% sure they're alive. I mean, come on. Most people aren't ever that alive in their entire lives. What does that even mean? Yeah, I catch your drift. Sounds like nonsense. Well, well what does that even mean? <laughs> or I don't know. Any of these, honestly. I, I, I'm on one or three, personally. Sure, What's yeah. one? I don't know. What does anything mean, really? Andre. Oh, yeah. Andre. <laughs> Sounds like nonsense. You're right. It is nonsense. Total garbage. I knew you'd see through it. You're one smart cop. It feels oh man, do we get played? Cop, doesn't it? That's a good cop to be. <laughs> Has a nice ring to it. Smart cop. You wouldn't want to be stupid cop now, would you? But still, maybe he's just sucking up to you. You can stop buttering me up now. Thank you. I get it. Now where do you? <laughs> where? Okay. I get by. Yeah. I yeah. Get by. Sorry. Um. Uh. Either one of these. Yeah. The first one. I guess oh, the first okay. one. I won't do that anymore. Sure, man. Okay. Tell us what you want to know. Let's do it. Who exactly are these people inside the church? Yeah. Truth is, I don't really know. None of us do. I don't even know how many there are. All we've seen are glimpses. Uh, you haven't even seen them and you want the police to be involved? And better safe than sorry, anything more you can tell me? Uh, I, uh, hmm. These are both interesting responses. Mm, I guess one? Well, there's also the machinery. This machinery is of what? the deeply mystical variety. Okay. When I first what? scouted the place back in February, it was abandoned, empty. Took some time getting the crew together. So about two weeks ago, we came here hoping to set the stuff up. Suddenly, there are all these strange machines lying around in there. One of them has wires running into bowls of water. Wires into water. Never seen anything like it. Andre. Tell him about the feeling. Oh, and it felt like there was something in there with us, watching us from the dark. What? Oh, the other one. Um, the which other, other one? one? I'm not as in tune with my emotions as you are, Egg. Felt like silence. Awful silence. Okay. For this man, even regular silence is awful enough. But that was something greater. Okay. All 
Hi. What? Was it a ghost? What? <laughs> Were they summoning what? a ghost? Ooh, I could, they're being exactly? spooky. We've just seen someone that we think is a woman go in and out of the church a couple of times. And we felt someone or something eyeing us inside. But that's kind of it. Okay, uh, what this was- is weird. <laughs> yeah, I, I have no idea. If I've gone quiet, it's because I genuinely don't know how to react to the- <laughs> Yeah, I, I agree. For what you're <laughs> yeah, I just kind of want to hear- like, I'm like, I'm just going to keep clicking at this point. Like, I don't know yeah. where we're going, but we're, we're along for the ride. What was, uh, what was that the... about something watching you? Can you tell me more about the machinery? So how can you be sure they're burnouts and dope heads if you haven't seen any of them? Um, okay. I guess go, t start from yeah. the top. Like, yeah. you aren't alone. You know, it wasn't quite human, if you know what I mean. Not human, as in a ghost. Do you know what he means? It was this dark shape climbing upside down along the ceiling, like some kind of crab man. Crab man? You know, uh, crab man? It was climbing up and around the ceiling. We found him. Like a crab. But... It was stalking itself. <laughs> Jeez, that <laughs> Odd. Crabs are usually <laughs> marine creatures. And not known for climbing. Thanks, walls. Encyclopedia. Always glad to have you involved in a conversation. Are you sure it was a <laughs> ambush behavior? Totally. I mean, I didn't personally see it. A cell was alone that time, but I believe her. If she comes out running and says there's a crab in there, there's a crab in there. You should ask her about it, but be nice. Don't tell her you don't believe in a crab. <laughs> okay, no. The implications of this are <laughs> too numerous to consider. Proceed with caution. <laughs> Learn all you can before entering that dark building. Can you tell me about the machinery? annoyed about that. I just got a distinct burnout and dope head sign from them. Probably jacked up to some snuff station too. Probably, very likely. Okay, but how can you be sure? Well, honestly, yeah. I can't, but I am. This is a below feeble attempt at avoidance. Basically, he is attempting to weaponize idiocy. Wow, you can't, but you do? I should add weaponized it is idiocy to my own repertoire. <laughs> I don't see a thing, single thing wrong with that argument. <laughs> it, Go with number one, I suppose. It kind of almost feels like if you just went along with everything he said, you might actually get in his good graces, but just being like one of his No, lackeys. you're right. But we're too That deep. was actually what I was just thinking. Yeah, <laughs> honestly. The thing is, we're too deep point. into it already. We've already contradicted him, but that would have been a really interesting way to go about it is to just lean into all of his approaches and see where it gets you. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, I, I totally, uh, yeah, I 100% don't see anything wrong with what you're saying right yeah. now. <laughs> yeah, and like approach it like that. Mm -hmm. uh, but it, I think but it's, right, too it's a little too late. Yeah. Hey yeah. Now, I'm 70% sure they're substance abusers. Don't let all that technology fool you. Where do you think the drugs come from? All right. Sure. What? <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. Uh, the, yeah That's the... a meteor and name for the founding party. Thought it'd be cool to use it. If you don't know what the founding party is, there might be a way to mask it with minor demagoguery. Before we go on, what do you mean by the meteorin? Mask it. Now humor me, Andre. What is the founding party? Don't also, mask very it. I don't even know what the founding party is. <laughs> yep. Very quickly, demagoguery. Oh, that's good. Good word. I I know the word demagogue, but I've never really con like contemplated the concept of demagoguery. It's pretty nice. It's, it's pretty it's nice. Good word. That's a yeah. good one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna mask uh, it with my demagoguery. Yeah, I would mask. Come to yeah. think of it, I've never really looked them up. You know, I can't give you a precise definition, but they're a very powerful religious organization. Uh, okay. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All right. Tell me about this tent. Yes. What? Uh, I see you brought your own water. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Good to have. Bitch to carry. And when it's... I first scattered the oh. place, I did some reconnaissance. I'm not sure the church even has running water. And it's distilled too. Uh, oh. He doesn't know what to say. It's the one they sell at the fuel station. It's like he's lying to you, my liege. <laughs> <laughs> my liege. Thank you, drama. All right, enough of this. He nods enthusiastically. No doubt. A little oh, holy relief. shit. Oh, this is so low. It's a, it's a white check. Let me let me see what clothes we can do. Maybe okay. everything isn't quite as you've been told. Take a moment to analyze. Okay. As always, we'll be right here. Okay. Also, we might be able to benefit from um talking to Noid a bit. Oh, Noid or or a cell? Yeah. Well, both. Wait, both of them? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, actually, maybe we do that. We talk to them and then we 
we approach him. That might be the way to go. Is this the percentage going down that chat keeps talking about, by the way? Uh, no, no. He, the, it was a, a running joke. Um, every time Andre spoke, he lowered his percentages. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. I, was, I kept getting lot. I was too busy looking at the chat and not figuring it out for myself. <laughs> so, uh, so, uh, but do you know I'm that sorry. feeling where you're like, I, I see it, but I'm too busy trying to figure it out and not oh, looking in 100%, front of me? percent. One hundred percent. Especially if you're only like glancing at chat, then glancing back at the game, you can kind of miss like a key instance. But yeah, it, it was just, it was just a, a joke from. Him. As always. Um, we'll okay, I got it up to twenty-eight, but that's by adding all of our all of our clothes. So okay. um, I'm gonna try so asking around. Talk with Andre, and now you want to discuss things with Noid. Good. Uh, skin shows through the holes uh, in the speed freak's too large sweater in front of him, <laughs> an open toolbox full of carpentry tools and parts. It's good you talked to Andre first. Gave me time to get a reading on your sign. Can't really talk to people before you get a reading. He runs his hand through his hair, which is combed back in mock seriousness and continues to fiddle with some gears. Business in the front, party in the back. Yep. <laughs> he Business really does He's that. very dedicated to it. I mean, like, it is a full on, that's a lot of work has gone into this. Oh, that's <laughs> someone who knows what they wanted and made it happen. Yeah, right? it's true. Uh, sign, I guess. Yeah, Do gotta compare. See if we can align. Interesting. I suck Interesting. at socializing, man. Even now, our sign synchronization is way off. But I'll see what I can do. He continues to rearrange his tools. I saw a sticker on the padlock. Can you tell me anything about it? A sticker? Yeah. You mean the yellow one? Can you describe it to me? Why describe it if you already know what I mean? Uh, <laughs> it's this one. Are you familiar with it? Show him the sticker in your ledger. Um, well, or do yeah, we well, might as well show it. I mean, he did it. ask us to describe it. Maybe we just describe it. Or do we want to show him? Uh, I would ask us to show him. Okay. Yeah, let's show him. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, Seems yeah. like my creation has found its way into the legal bureaucracy. What did you want to ask about it? What's it supposed to be? The dead guy yeah. smiling. Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> yep. What does it mean? <laughs> he defeated history. We are living in the age of history, and in the eyes of history, we are always already dead. How can we ever smile then? Because history is a lie, and so are its deaths. The present moment and life Oh, the hardcore. The hardcore expels death. My well, my head is totally dead. sideways now. Maybe because <laughs> I've been listening. The beats. God, the vibes this gives off though are so specifically yeah. like you're a teenager and you left the movies only to find at like midnight only to find out that your car is dead, so you need to find jumper cables. So you're sitting on top yep. of your car hoping that somebody yeah. drives by with bumper cables and talking to your friend about life. Like yeah. it's the most incredibly specific <laughs> feeling. It's so true. Like uh, uh, Vanoy and Chat made a an accurate comment of like getting like walking out of the house and forget your car keys. So you unlock the house and realize you have your car keys in hand. It's yeah. Like, <laughs> what? It's this just, is such. They're very teenagers. Although it's yeah. Weird. Uh, our, our self said something. Uh, our self said something like I I you know I got into trouble back when I was a teenager, which I was like, wait, are you not a teenager? But maybe yeah. she just meant she was a younger teenager than that. I can't maybe. tell. Yeah. Also, I do want to point out that we are at half health, by the way. I, because yeah, we I'm got aware. hit in the face. Okay. Yeah, I'm aware of that, Allison. I can't, <laughs> there's nothing I can do. <laughs> I know, but just throwing that out I appreciate there. that, but I'm, I'm powerless to help. <laughs> Oh god, I think maybe the smiling dead guy is a symbol for communism. It's also dead but doesn't care. Let's do it. <laughs> See what he says. I is guess. It, is it I can't It's not it. though. Ah! No, because the whole idea is if you're if you're doing the communism thing, it's like communism died and I alone will resurrect it. So yes. Yeah. That interpretation holds. I think we've exhausted well, the subject. I could write yes. an entire treatise <laughs> on the thing. <laughs> oh, oh. Tell me about the machines you saw in the church. Weird yeah. stuff. Specialized. There was a data processor and some sort of long wave machinery. Wires going into water. Gives off a spy sign. Or some fucked up Samaran science sign. You know, the kind that goes head first into the supernatural. What's wrong with the supernatural? Nothing's wrong with it. You should definitely be researched. 
You can still do sick shit with it, though. The sickest. <laughs> That's perhaps why it should be researched. Okay. The sickest. <laughs> do you think it's real that it actually exists? Most of it doesn't yeah. exist. But there's also stuff that isn't allowed to exist. Because the moralists think it's too dangerous for the plebs. Sonic powers, pale-related diseases, pretenders pretending to be human, folk rights, that kind of stuff. Okay. These, uh, these guys. <laughs> I know, these kids are what, so funny. Yeah, what about now? Are the signs all right now? I want to ask him that. Hmm. Still strongly at a sink. Stage gamma disalignment. What? You heard me. <laughs> Oh, oh man. aesthetic is esoteric. It's not meant to be discussed with the law at this moment. Man, he it's is such a vibe. To achieve harmonic <laughs> resonance of signs without some adjustment. Does that mean we need sign matching? Yes. Oh. Further sign matching would do good for us. One way to achieve this would be by getting us into the church. Okay, all right. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, it oh, we got we got that as a task, you. though. Yeah, and the signs are not in sync. Guess you need to help him and his friends out somehow. Prove that you're one of the crew. Who knows what I'll tell you. Okay. <laughs> I do like that. What about uh, do you, we want to talk to Egg? Egg? <laughs> side on here holds up a Harmon Walshy tape player, nodding along to the music. He looks at you with a knowing smile. And like says, the jam and cat. As though you're supposed to be sharing some tremendous evangelical secrets. Hardcore! Is it's it? It's hardcore! <laughs> you're just gonna keep saying it's hardcore, aren't you? I don't hardcore! know what to say to that. <laughs> I don't like either of these responses. I want to go, fuck yeah, but we don't have that option. Is it hardcore, though, Allison? Do we really believe that? <laughs> It's probably medium core, given what we just heard them playing in this tent when we exactly, walked in. Exactly, right? <laughs> yeah, it's so hardcore. Skibba D, skibba danger. I am the rearranger. Now, Egghead. Oh, God. God. Egghead. What to do? Jake, you need to turn that into a song by the end of the night. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. Sk skibba D, skibba danger. I am the rearranger. This. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, could there have been a, a right challenge. way out of this garden of forking paths, you think? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Wow, cool. that uh, was... I'm gonna go talk to this song. <laughs> wild. <laughs> that was buck wild. <laughs> well, we have a riddle. We need to sync signs. And... Yep. <laughs> and we look like this still. And we look like this still, so, you know. The shaggy hit girl kneels on the sea ice. She looks up as you approach. So you talk to my associates, right? Are you gonna help us? Can't say- With the church, I mean. I'll help you all right. Can't say I gotta ask some questions first. Um, I guess that. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, there's yeah, not a current we... that everyone's lying to us, which is pretty obvious. Like literally all of our, yeah. all, all of our mental voices are like, okay, maybe check this one before <laughs> you wreck yeah. this one. Yeah. Shoot. Okay, uh, the others told me you went inside the church. What did you see in there? Oh, yeah. That. You're not going to believe me. There's no point in me telling you. If she She's says crab. To blurt it out, crab man, than the others. Okay, She's, going, okay. she's the one that said crab in the first place. Yeah. If she doesn't say crab, then no one says crab. We'll see. Here I say crab. <laughs> I went in and I saw a woman next to one of those machines there. Noid calls it a mainframe. She was okay. dressed like someone who's been raised by their grandmother, you know, strange old clothes. Had this absent expression, didn't say anything, just stood still. Go on. And then, okay. you know, right behind her, a man crawled down the wall, upside down like a crab, down the church wall. I think the woman didn't even know he was there. He was completely silent. He stopped Wait, right before crab. he got to the floor. Crab? And just hung crab. there like that, looking at me, right at me. I fucking turned around and walked out. End of story. Okay. All right. <laughs> she just All right. stood there. Crab. Menacingly. <laughs> like a crab, Sorry. you say? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Kim. You haven't followed like this whole crab. story. <laughs> Welcome back crab. to the conversation. Uh, what did this crab man look like? It was too dark. <laughs> I couldn't tell exactly. It's 
reminds me of the crab from Umurangi Generation. And it just it fills me with feelings. Uh, yeah, that fucking crab and Um. I watched that bit three days ago, Gina. Really? I'm not lying. Yeah, because I thought about <laughs> spoilers for anyone who hasn't watched Umurangi. But in the last level of the game in our playthrough, Gina takes this picture of a crab randomly and it is then the only thing you see for the entire credits being like what a beautiful photo you've taken but it's like kind of a shitty photo it's not, of a of a crab. It's not only of a crab it's not a great picture of a crab oh my god and i thought about it and laughed and then i looked it up <laughs> what i love is that the one day i was over at gina's place i'm like is that is that a, a a stuffed crab on the floor, and Gina's like, "Yeah, my parents got it for us when they heard about the crab incident in Umurangi Generation." Yeah. Oh. And I, I love that so much. <laughs> Crabs, they haunt me. Crab, egg, Crabs. and crab. Egg, crab, <laughs> all of them. Great uh, words. Oh, it makes me so happy. She obviously could. She already went into detail. I sort of felt so bad about wrecking the end of that playthrough. <laughs> Are you kidding? Gina, we sucked for every moment of that playthrough. It was perfect. It's true. It was, it, it was, it was the only way to end that playthrough. We were so <laughs> abysmal oh, at crap. that game. Literally, the ongoing joke of that playthrough was we'd start and be like, okay, maybe we'll be good this time. <laughs> and then we wouldn't be. And we'd waste 10 goddamn minutes. And all the comments are people being like, I was screaming. And I'm I'm like me I too. Know, me too. <laughs> I was also screaming. Nothing is worse than editing of a, a playthrough like that when you're like, God, you dumb, dumb losers from the past. Why did you not see it? The kiwi is right there. <laughs> There's no way to know. <laughs> you just like, I want to like circle it every time you can see the things in the <laughs> camera frame. It's like there it is. There it is. That is right. Dude, I think that's that is the one weakness of our uh, um, YouTube editing video, like, you know, abilities, mm -hmm. that we can't do all of those things where we're like, and this is the correct answer. <laughs> like, <laughs> Just freeze frame, ding, here it is. No. If only they knew. <laughs> Just wait five minutes, <laughs> spoiler alert, we'll get there, but not Every now. Every once in a while, like, Allison will do something fancy, and I really appreciate it. Yeah, right. I'm, I, I've been doing it too long. It's, I, I've gotten, <laughs> I've been worn you down by time. Um, I feel like you can tell when I edit episodes, because I like to, to spice it up a little bit. <laughs> Allison, I, show, I haven't edited a video in a long while for for complete but i used to be like oh look at all these tricks and then also, yeah. now i'm just like it's up i did it like no dude same i'm like i've been editing every day for the past yeah gina you're a whole different years I I'm might, not allowed to complain if i remember i might drop a picture of my cat when she's mentioned but there's only so much I can do. <laughs> I, Gina, I'll apologize right now for every single time ever we've done a playthrough in which I said there would be a picture that goes up and either you were like, fuck you for that like a month later or you texted me saying you edited this and didn't put that yep, shit in and I'm like, you're right. Favorite. You're I'm straight like, up dude, right. I can't post this. You talked, you made a bit. You have to go back. Also, <laughs> Inspector Clark, thank you. That's the most investment I put in an edit. That was Gina ever. on that one. <laughs> yes. On the Witcher one. That was, we we looked at each other at the end and we're like what are we gonna do and i'm like I'm, i'll yeah. take care of it don't you worry <laughs> yeah. Wait, what did you censor I, did you there's, have bad there's language? an incredibly graphic stupid sex scene in the witcher and i animated black bars over it for... and and oh, gina's awesome. little who could say uh uh <laughs> could say um uh emo made an appearance that's awesome. too. God, that, that scene was so funny <laughs> i say incredibly stupid with a lot of affection it's a really funny oh. sex scene but also it is an incredibly stupid sex scene it, it is a very intentionally stupid sex scene and it's very <laughs> good it's very very good um, but it did require way more. I thought it was a lot shorter than it was when I started animating the <laughs> it goes parts. on. Oh, God. <laughs> right. I, you know what? Thank you, Inspector Clark, for reminding me that I did put in an effort once. Yeah. So. Hell yeah. yeah. We all, you know, we need someone in our lives who will remind us we put in an effort yeah. once. 
I, I wish that there had been more Mukuro Ikusaba uh, 16 student counts in Duncan Rumpa because I did enjoy doing those. They, they disappeared <laughs> Just, after a little while, but yes, yeah, those were, unfortunately. Those were fun <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Oh, my God. Anyway. Good shit. <laughs> Um, Pickles Workshop, it's a fun <sighs> one. We have a great time. <laughs> Even if you're not too into The Witcher, hopefully we, we make it entertaining. <laughs> I'm into The Witcher. It's, it's fun. Oh, it's no, a fucking, I, I'm into The Witcher. I just mean, I know I know some people that watch it aren't big Witcher fans, which is valid. Oh, like, yeah, yeah. We weren't totally either valid. when we kicked it off. Um, mm -hmm, but mm -hmm. now we're like that 80 is, hours into it. So That's very true. That is an interesting game where we started playing it being like, not we didn't really have strong feelings either way about this game but now like we're here and we're in it and i'm enjoying it immensely and <laughs> yeah it's great <laughs> you've been playing I, that I game loved for warming so long. to that we game we have and like we're, i think we're still in act 1 like i don't know what to do. it's amazing <laughs> <laughs> i could be wrong but i think we might be in act 1 still <laughs> oh thank you kafeka thank you <laughs> really appreciate that <laughs> okay all right Sorry, sorry. Back in, back in. Okay, back, okay. back in the disco. Um, All right, disco hips. Uh, yeah. Uh, come on, oh, obviously. Uh, come on, quit stalling. What did he look like? You're right. I don't believe you. You're wrong. I do believe you. Maybe this one. What? Allison, you were wrong. What I what? What? She said we wouldn't believe her. Oh, oh, oh. So oh, we either oh, can oh. say, "Tell me more." I don't believe, believe you. I do believe you. Do we believe I, she saw a crab man? I oh. do. Let's say we do. Yeah. We like this Why? woman. Seems too ludicrous oh. for a lie. What would you stand again? Strange things happen. It seems too ludicrous for a lie. Yeah. I guess so. Anyway, what else? Uh, are we get okay? But for real, are we? Are they? Are these kids playing as hardcore, or are we about to get into some weird, freaky, spooky we're, shit? We're not. In this we're game? not going in the. Uh, sorry, I, I was about to make a, a blanket statement without actually consulting. I, I was of the opinion we don't go in the church until we know what's going on. Fair. Well, yes, that's what I mean. But I mean, I, I, from uh, tonally. Oh. Like, are we being played by these children? I, I don't think it's spooky. I, I mean, I or, think probably something weird's going on in there. But but it seems like okay. they know too much about whatever it is. Like, they're trying mm -hmm. to... I, I don't know. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, like to know more about your associates? My associates? I haven't got much to say about them. Uh, what do you mean? You must know something about them? Of course I do. I just don't tell people about my friends and who they are and so on. I don't provide information on them. To the cops. What about you? Tell me something about yourself. Maybe I'll ask later about this. Mm, wait, which one? I'm just the, saying the these are one? these are the two answers. Tell me something okay. about yourself or I'll ask later about this. I, I guess tell me um, something about Yeah, um, let's I don't want to end the conversation yet. Yeah, me neither. Me. That's kinda... I'm a silver bird. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, ask about this don't later. Know what makes okay, you think fine. It'll be any different later, but Okay, we got a I mean, task though. Your point, but we did get a task. That's <laughs> true. Sorry about that. Okay. okay, what is the task actually? It's so I'll refuse to talk about her friends. Maybe she'll open up later after you've helped them set up the nightclub. Okay, all right, all right. All right. Okay, we gotta go. Uh, all right, that's fine. Um, do we this freaking nightclub? Like, for these we children. have the key, right? Yeah, we have the key. I think so. Yeah. So we could go in, but we don't want to yet, right? Yeah, I mean, we not could. yet. Not until we just have more information, in my opinion. Will you thank you. What's this? Trash. Okay, you're picking up trash. Nice, nice, nice. No, um, I'm not successfully picking up trash, but I just wanted oh. to get this thought. Come away from no. them, just like yours. What is this? Lower okay. this. Lower this. Oh. The pain of Etonite has been planted into the snow. Two poles are holding it up. Barely holding it up. It could fall over any minute. A stronger gust of wind might be enough. Push it. The pain falls into the icy snow with a soft thunk. Bridge. Thank you. <laughs> Yay. Okay, cool. And that's Look, money. Look, we made a bridge. It only took like 10 seconds. That's not money? A lot. not money, it turns out. Oh. All right, that's fine. Boo. All right. Wait, so I'm a little confused. Should we not have taken that bribe earlier? Chat did not like that, but. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Um, it's gonna pay. It's gonna pay for us having a roof over our heads later. So <laughs> and our dice. 
And, and it'll, die. it'll be nice. burn dice. Yeah. yeah. Uh, take those that. Are, those are important. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's fair. We do like the kids, but I, the this, the uh, fact that that's how the situation went was very funny, and we didn't really have. A, I mean, we could have said no to the bribe, but yeah, that, but I didn't. No, we, no, we couldn't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we could have. Well, we yeah, I like yours, but yes, I hear that, but n I didn't, though. I yeah. Guess. Because here's the deal that bribe is going to pay for me healing my eye that just got hurt. Um, <laughs> is this about the questions again? Wait, no, it's not. It's, How do I actually buy stuff here? I've never done it. <laughs> uh, the case? You t click on the case? That thing? A small or that thing? cabinet on the wall is filled with various medicine. That bottles. one, probably, right? Yes. Um. Just ask me if you need anything from Saint Batiste. Okay. We don't stop. Okay. Yeah, I'll meds, just. I just. We do have Nosafed, Duramine, Magnesium, and Hypnogamma. I don't know why we'd ever I need to heal her. three health because we only have two bars. So I'm gonna just do the Nosafed. I mean, okay. one day we yeah. might have another I bar. Think Saint Batiste makes true, you feel but better. We don't or right something. now. Okay. Cool. Done. All right. Thank you. And it only costs ninety cents, so we still have thirty bucks. Perfect. Why he needed to Love give it. us twenty five dollars, uh, but that's okay. We'll take. It. Honestly, I'm here for. <laughs> I'm not gonna look a gift horse in the mouth anymore. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna say we got money, and I'm feeling a little better. Mm -hmm. um, um, I came right. over here. Sorry, I realized I didn't share my logic. I came over here to talk to the cockatoo lady. Okay. Uh, I know that's completely lady. Oh, yeah. unrelated to what we were doing right then, but I figured might as well. Oh wait, now now wait. we're now. Hmm. Uh, hmm. Um, maybe she's inside. Okay. Yeah. Maybe maybe she only comes here at certain times a day. Maybe. Mm. Or maybe I mean we talked to her yesterday while we were trying to eat time, so maybe she's not here today. Um. Where? Hmm. Bro, that was yesterday. Shit. Sorry, Clark. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. All the days blend together. Well, yeah. Yeah. Wait. Was it yesterday? Yeah, it was. It was day two that she was here, right? Yeah, no, yeah. totally. I just thought she might yeah. still be here. That's all. I thought maybe she would come back. It, yeah, we we mm -hmm. haven't seen all that many other characters that have like she's still here, and I know that she works here, but I just wanted to see if. Um, Wonder where her home is. Too much. Yeah. Hmm. We don't. I guess we could come. I mean, she's often there, so. Maybe we just check back in every so often an at various times of the day. Nothing to see. Oh, here. sorry. I just wanted to see if we had progressed on this one. But the answer oh, on the wall is no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and that's okay. Um, all right, um, all right. Then we can we can go back. Um, damn. Yeah. What do we want to do about this church? Uh, I guess I could call the station about the dead body. Ooh, and library oh. card. Library card. That's oh, what we yeah. need to do next. Yeah, yeah, good point, good point. All right. The library card is folded into two and still slightly wet to the touch. The front side reads, Central General Public Library Card, issued to Billy Mejean, expires July 53. Billy. Billy okay. is a unisex name. Could be the deceased or his family member. Inside. Whoever oh, owns yeah. this card oh, yeah. is an avid reader. You find a list of books written in blue pencil. Radio thriller. Stand a little less between me and the sun. The last one in the list is The Glinton Curve by M. Theobald. A library stamp indicates that the book has been returned. Most of these titles seem to be in the sci-fi genre. Some thrillers too. If lost, okay. please return the card to the library. Dial. Zero zero five zero two five five two one one, or visit us at Moreau Street, seventy eight Jamrock. Business hours nine hundred to eighteen hundred. Good. We should give them a call from my kinema. See if we can learn anything about Billy Mejean. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So we that can do great. that at the car and report the body at the car. So that's yeah. Let's go do that. Yep. Yep. Two birds with one stone. Perfect. And then. Also, do you guys want to do our break after that? Sure. Sure. Absolutely. Just yeah. And timing wise. Yeah. That yeah, that works great. for me. Kind of want to go ooh, ooh, get there. some tea. Oh. Working class drunk. You know what this means, right? What? What? 
I actually have no idea. I actually have no idea. I genuinely what that means. have no uh, idea. Well, I, I, I'll, okay. I'm gonna do case solved so that we can figure out what they mean. Yeah. What? What? Yeah. Cracked it. All in a good day's work. Wait, what did I crack Wait. exactly? Open a shop. Yeah. Like, yeah. What did I crack? What do you mean? What did I crack? Look at how working class that drunk is. It's her husband, the missing husband. Yeah. Okay, all right, okay. Yeah. Got it, got this it, got is, it. Yes. We're, we're suddenly and getting you it. found him. Now go and tell the working class woman. Protect and serve, recruit. Didn't she repeatedly Thanks, tell you her husband isn't missing, though? But he is missing. You heard her. The worry in her voice. This doesn't add up. I'm only making a fool of myself. I, I mean... Convince campaign I'm going in. Um... I mean, this was our theory. I don't love how this it's was presented, theory. but this yeah, was but our theory. Yeah, but now they're framing it like, uh, hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm, give me the champagne. I'm we, going we, in. We, we, need, we there's need to no go. Need for champagne when there's honor recruit. <laughs> go and tell the working class woman what you found right now. We would. She's not there. We tried. She's not, Unless she's, she's not suddenly here. there now. She Unless she's here? there now. Authority. Authority. Look. Authority. Uh, no, authority. <laughs> Solve this question for me, authority. Tell me, tell me if you see her. <laughs> authority, you <laughs> see her. Authority. Actually, want to help? Uh, <laughs> oh God, that's interesting. Um, Inside, you see a set of steering levers, a radio microphone, a pull-out toolbox, and the soft glow of the fuel preheater gauge. Well, we couldn't we couldn't have seen this. Sorry, I'm responding to chat. We couldn't have seen that thought earlier because we talked to her on day two. And we found the body on day three, which was the first yep. day we could have found the body. So but maybe we were maybe when we found the body, we were supposed to get that thought. Like maybe I think we just got the thought when we were back where she was. Maybe. Mm. Or maybe she was supposed to be there when we got the thought, but she was she's not like, I don't know something. Do you think it's like bugged out? Do you think something happened where? No, I don't know. It's hard. I just think it probably happened in a weird order. You know, like just our events. Okay, chat. It chat to be seems different. to think that that it was a bug because apparently there was supposed oh, really? to be a body on the oh. steps, but there wasn't because that body was there yesterday. Um, oh, on those steps that we were just on. I don't know. Okay, I mean, it, huh. it made that's sense weird. with our own conclusion, but um, but clearly that's not what it was actually meant to do. Well, so, hey, whatever. Yeah. Fast, Regardless, we'll just makes not bring us, up but... the drunk when. Well, we'll bring up the other drunk when we talk to her. Um. Yeah. 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 Exactly. And we need to look into the library card anyway, which is gonna. Yeah, that's which what should help right clear now. things up. Yeah. Exactly. How may I assist you? Um. Let's see. Okay. Uh, report a body. One moment. Uh, you can oh, it was just a drunk guy. Oh, okay, okay. A but he didn't spawn on the steps the because of that. That's why we're confused, is he wasn't actually there. Got it. Yeah. Yep. Okay, an unidentified middle-aged man, height uh, 170 to 175 centimeters, dark hair, medium build. Looks like he slipped and fell through a hole in the boardwalk and hit his head against the metal bench. We suspect mm -hmm. he might have been inebriated when he fell. There were bottles all around him. And traces of vomit on his shirt. Any yeah, kind of violence? Yeah, pretty obvious. Uh, no, it seems like it was an accident. Somebody might have pushed him. No, it seems like it was an accident. At least. It's like an yeah. accident. No, yeah. it's an accident. Yeah. What about his belongings? Did you examine his clothes? He's wearing boots, trousers, and an old leather jacket with a bright blue lining. I found a live, excuse me, a library card. Any information mm -hmm. on the library card? It's from the Central Jamrock Public Library. It belongs to someone named Billy Mejon. Good. You mm -hmm. have a lead. Do you and Lieutenant Kitsuragi want to take the case, or should I assign it to someone else? We're taking the case. I have a uh, we'll Lieutenant take it. Lieutenant Kitsuragi. Please wow, follow up on the library to identify cases. the man. <laughs> no kidding. We send someone to take the body mm. to the morgue. That's all for uh, now. We do not Thank have you time for to deal with. In. Is there anything else I can do for you? Yep, connect me to Jamrock Public Library. Hold on. Mm -hmm. I've got Central Jamrock Public Library on the line, and I've already introduced you to the librarian. Connecting the call in two, one. Yes, this is Central Jamrock Public Library here. How can I help you, officer? He sounds worried, yet ready to assist. This is how people get when the police call. I'm looking for any information yeah. that you can provide on Billy Mijon, a reader. Billy, mm -hmm. Billy Mijon, you said. Give me a moment, I'll have to check our database. 
I really like the sound editing for the phone. By the I way. like it a yeah, lot. Yeah, me too. Yeah, I was just thinking that, Gina. Thank you for saying it's something. really nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Also, I agree with chat. Alice is great. She rules. Uh huh. Yes. Hello. Are you still there? I found Billy Majon's home address. Is that all right? No phone number, unfortunately. They're too poor to have a phone line. Uh, yes. Home address is fine. Sure. Here we go, yeah. sir. Rue de Saint Gislain, 33B, apartment number 20. It's in Martinez, I believe. Cape Side Apartments, it says. That's where the smoker on the balcony lives. Done. Isn't it? Mm. Uh, so, 33B, all right? 33B. On the oh, no, apartment yeah, number 20. Apartment number 20. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Uh, do you have any other information on Billy? It says here that they returned their last book just a few days ago, but I wasn't at work that day. Okay. Do you know someone who was? Marie? Yeah, yeah, might as well ask. Marie, do you remember a reader named Billy Majon? They returned a Tibalt book the other day. You hear someone answer from afar. Yes, it, it was my colleague, Marie. Uh, she said that it was Billy's husband who returned the book. He also asked for this new sci-fi release, Lowe's Radio City 87. But we don't... Oh, I guess we yet. know... We know that the woman was, re like, really into sci-fi, right? Wasn't she, like, looking at all the sci-fi books, yeah, like, I mean, outside it, it, the bookstore? It, it seems like we've solved this. Yeah. Like, yeah, we yeah. could be wrong, but it feels like we've Good. solved this. You we have, have most of the now. information that's necessary. Yeah. yeah. It, 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 we a little bit jump to conclusions, but all of the backfilled information has supported <laughs> yeah. our, our initial, our initial assumption. No, so. we picked up on it. Yeah. So. <laughs> uh, so Billy Michonne was a woman, not a man. How did your colleague know that it was her husband? Did you know the husband's name? Let's, yeah. Sorry. Yeah, no. I guess that. Marie only knows him by sight. Okay. Marie knows Billy. She's been working here longer than me. Sometimes her husband returns some books for her. Okay. And then go okay. for a little drink later. Okay. On the lookout. Can Marie describe mm -hmm. to me what the husband looked like? Marie! Sure. She said it was an older man, and that she's pretty sure he'd had a drink or two the last time she saw him. What was he wearing? Uh, All right. One second. What was he wearing? I really, I really, this is my, it it's feels so, very much so like, good. yeah, it feels like a, like a radio player or a podcast or something mm -hmm. like that. Like it's really well edited. Mm -hmm. I'm really you know feeling what, it. You know what the sound design reminded Sorry. me of? And, and this is weird because it's a very different kind of medium, but it reminded me of her story. Oh yeah. A little oh, yeah. bit. Yeah. It, the asides, the, the, yeah, no, I get yeah. that. Yeah. What was the sequel we played? Uh, um, Telling Lies. Telling lies, that was it. Oh yeah, that one that was a really interesting game. Mm -hmm. That was a weird game. Telling yeah. lies specifically was a weird one. It was a bit bizarre. It was all over the place. Her story feels a lot more contained. Uh, Telling lies was very ambitious. Um and yeah, I, and fun, was, but ambitious. That was really more it. Her story was contained and like thus easier for them to execute. Telling lies was like all over the goddamn mm -hmm. place. It was cool in theory. But in execution, they took on a lot. Like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it was a cool game, though. Those it was like a, it was definitely wild. like a really high concept game. Yeah. Oh and yeah. And there were like yeah. really cool moments in it, but it was it was a little. Whew, it was a little bit. Um, for anyone who doesn't know, they're they're both AMV uh, AMV FMV 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 full motion FMV, videos. Yeah. Yeah, 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 where they're they're actual actors, actual people doing things, um, and they're like mystery solve them games, and they're cool. Uh... <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, they're yeah. really neat, both of them, um, and both have have fun little twisty stories, which are delightful, um, if odd. Um, Sorry, mm -hmm. Marie, was watch us play them on Short One that. Gaming. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Tell your friends. <laughs> Like, subscribe, <laughs> comment. <laughs> Honestly, that is a good Spring reminder to like and subscribe. Smash that like button. <laughs> and by we that I just... mean none of those because this this definitely is Twitch at this moment. But if you're on YouTube in the future, do all those things. What? Uh, you are I, here. I have... You could throw I, a, you could throw a sub or a follow our way over here on 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 Twitch TV yeah. slash Short One Gaming. You know, <laughs> so. every every now and then God. I I see someone in chat be like, "You guys do let's plays," and I'm like, "The fuck are you? How do you find us?" 
<laughs> that it is it what is are you really doing fascinating here? because like i forget that we've been on twitch long enough that there are one or two people that only know that we're on twitch <laughs> but it shows like that's Funny, very odd like... oh. <laughs> i'm just saying we are we're not close don't get me wrong we're not close but we're on our way to 20,000 subs, so I'm just saying, we're, if you can help us out. That, 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 pump doesn't, those even, that doesn't even make sense to me. I don't understand. That's <laughs> no. insane. And I know, like, we're literally, like, not close. But <laughs> if, you, if, you, if you want, help us out, baby. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Make us that coin, baby. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Unrelated, uh, just responding to, to Victor talking about our cilantro emote, I just want to say, <laughs> Corey has been sitting in my, in my lap literally this entire stream, which is very oh. rare. She hasn't moved. Wow. She's not done anything. She's just sat here and been perfect. And I and I love oh, her for that. That sounds so good. She's wow. just such a perfect little cat. Oh, she's so good. And now that I'm acknowledging her, she's probably going to leave. <laughs> oh. <laughs> ah. oh. Um. All right. Uh, thank you. That's all for me. I have no other questions in this. Thank you, everybody in the chat. Goodbye. <laughs> Anything else you need from me? That is all. Seventh over and out. In the cabin, you see a set of steering levers. A right. God, this is a lot right. that we have right now. It really. <laughs> we <laughs> always love to dress to the nine. <laughs> oh, okay, gosh. wait. Do we want to take our break right now? Yeah, we do let's indeed. take. We could take a quick break, but uh, take five real quick. Yeah, um, I think that is a right great back. call. Get some water, do a little stretch. I'm probably not moving because that would disrupt my cat, but everybody yep, else can't does. do that. <laughs> um, yeah, we will be right back in just a moment. And when we pick up, we will hopefully track down Bernie or yeah, Bernie. Is it Bernie? Billy. Billy. I was like, Bernie's not right. That's incorrect. <laughs> Bernie Sandworm is in the chat right now. No. <laughs> <laughs> Billy Bajan is no. the woman we're looking for. <laughs> I do think that's exactly what happened, by the way. I think I read Bernie Sandworm and got distracted. <laughs> Billy. Billy. We're very, we're very glad you found us, Bernie Sandworm. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, gosh. Um, yeah, and we'll do that. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> we'll see, see you, you shortly. Just a bit. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Disco Elysium. Oh my God, we're back. All we're right, back. we. We're letting you in on the conversation we, we were doing we started, off screen. That... We started to do a deep dive into a conversation off stream. We're like, we should probably, we're going to just be doing this for the next like 10 minutes. So we probably should take the I started, I started off, off uh, uh, mic because I was too ashamed. But then I, I didn't know Gina was with me on this. But then you got so love like, and support from your sister. So. Yeah. And now I feel, and now I feel like I can talk with people about it. So I just in like a day and a half completed the entire first season of the circle on netflix the re the social media reality tv game show yep and <laughs> it is it is simultaneously the trashiest television i've ever watched in my whole goddamn life and also like such a good social experiment like what the fuck <laughs> it is it is absolute garbage but it also i i binge watched all of season two and I think one evening. <laughs> like, yes. like, okay, the first episode of both seasons are trash, but I, I have not watched season two. But season one, like, some of the participants get so shockingly charming, which you would never believe because they have these, like, fucking awful I would never opening. believe. <laughs> oh my, no, 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 no. Their opening introductions where you get to know them are, like, the most disgusting, like, almost vomit inducing things you'll ever see they're all neon lights and they're these awful people being like i'm from brooklyn and <laughs> i fuck women sometimes <laughs> and i'm so fucking charming mm, look really? at me but then that guy later in the season you're like why are you actually so charming yeah, he, like that's he's not he's bizarrely <laughs> the best character sense. in the season backing up oh just a little God. bit to explain Please. what the circle is <laughs> oh yes yeah yes. it's a weird game show where like i yeah you know it's a game show they're competing for a reality prize. show yeah um where uh people are basically locked in a room separated from one another. They're not allowed to interact with anybody except for through a fake social media program called The Circle. 
Um, so they have to make friends and influence people while <laughs> never being able to show their face or their use their voices. They have to only be like communicate through text. Um, yeah, and yeah. like at the end of every episode, not at the end, but like the way it works is that then the group themselves vote. They're like they vote everyone in order of who they like the most to who they like the least. And then those votes tally up who goes home. So you want to like strike this balance of making everybody like the persona you're giving off. And some people are like being them and some people are catfishing people. So they're deliberately changing everything to try to create a persona that they think people will like and vote for. It's really fascinating. It's, it is dumb as bricks to be clear. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> it is, it is no, incredibly it's so dumb. like silly, but, but I did binge watch both seasons year, a year apart. Cause I watched them both when they came out, but uh, yeah, I, I'll admit I will to say, that. Clark. <laughs> yeah. Clark, if you did not like Love Is Blind when I recommended Love Is Blind, you're gonna fucking hate the circle. <laughs> like <laughs> that is almost Everything. that is almost definitely true. I'm not recommending I, it. I'm just saying that I watched it with I, great yeah. fervor. <laughs> I also, watched it. I'll, I'll also like I was like I, anytime I'd sit down, I'd be watching it on my phone because I'm like, what are these fuckers up to? Like, <laughs> I also can't stop thinking about, I'm from Brooklyn, I fuck women. I'm <laughs> from Brooklyn, I fuck women, I go to the gym, I'm charming and I love my mom. And then at the end of the season, you're like, he does love his mama! He does love yeah! his mom! He does fuck funny. women! Yeah, he does woo! No, I'm serious though, like, Gina, you agree, right? No, 110%. <laughs> That like, is exactly who that man best. is, and he is also the best character in season yeah, one. Yeah, totally who I'm he talking does about. Fuck women. There was, Look there at him there was go. this. There was, there was this, there was this moment. There was times where people would be like, "I don't know, I fucking hate that guy," and I was also like, "Yeah, fuck that guy, right?" And then there was like this moment where the characters themselves are like, "Okay, wait." He's so charming. <laughs> and I, as they said it, I'm like, okay, is it bad that I've been rooting for him for like three <laughs> episodes? Why is this guy so likable? <laughs> and he is, he never stops being, I'm from Brooklyn. No, I it's not like they women. peel back a facade and reveal his no. soft, you know, gooey center. It's just like literally that's just, who he is. But you, at, by the end of it, you're like, yeah, you do. You're like, you. oh, yeah. you're like right. that is who you are. <laughs> and you know who you are, god damn it. And everyone, all the women on the show, they're like, okay, he flirted with me, but I said no, and he respected it, and now we're best friends. And, like, he does fuck women. Like, he totally does it. Like, <laughs> He's a little horn dog. Yeah, like, mad respect. <laughs> mad respect. Like, he will shoot his shot every time he gets a chance. But, like, fucking go the fuck living off. living his truth. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. They're like, there's nothing to doubt about this guy. This guy will not lie to us. <laughs> <laughs> so, long story short, I would never, ever, ever, <laughs> ever say... I recommend The Circle, but also... <laughs> you have watched all of it. But also, it's a great time. <laughs> it's a re it's a really good time. And it's, like, shockingly heartfelt. Sometimes. It's awful in the best. Um, my last recommendation that is a real recommendation, um, before we get back to playing this game, mm -hmm, is mm -hmm. there is an album that came out this week, guys. It is called A Perfect Little Death. And it is by a, a perfect little death. I'm sorry, I said death, like hard of hearing. A perfect little death. death. Um, and it is by a band called Souf slash Sand. And what Souf slash Sand stands for is Sufjan Stevens slash Stephen Sondheim. Whoa! Yes, oh. yes, you know it right. It is a woman who did a whole bunch of Sondheim songs in the style of Sufjan Stevens. And it is just terrific. Some of my favorites are Joanna Reprise. I really like their Send in the Clowns. I think their Being Alive is terrific. And In Buddy's Eyes is crazy shit. So I highly recommend it. It is such a fascinating Damn. album. Whoa. Yeah. That is- I will that look is... that up and or you should send me that. <laughs> Please text it to me. That's it a is, good wreck. I have it I pulled just, up and I'm ready to go. You right now, Gina. Thank it you. is it is so wild. Oh my god, that rules. It rules. That does rule. It totally rules. It's one woman and she is awesome. She's so cool. They did oh no no no. They did being alive, they did finishing the hat, they did losing my mind, they did the ballad of Sweeney Todd motherfuckers, they did Sunday. Oh, 
Oh yeah, but imagine that like all ethereal and acoustic guitar I'm based. I'm so excited. Like, Thank you so much for sending that to me. Oh, uh, is it on Beat Source? That's where I found it. Uh, it's just on uh, Spotify. Oh, it's on Spotify. Okay. Yeah. Oh wait. Maybe Apple Music. I'm only get in the chat here. Yeah. I it's just, just it's a it's a killer listen. It got me right in my feels because especially in like that genre, some of those Sondheim lyrics, you're like, ooh, that hits. Ow. <laughs> I am Damn, so excited. That's awesome. I cannot wait to check that out. Yeah, right, I'm excited to listen to this. In recommendations, I just was thinking about it during break. That cool. is cool. Thank you for sharing. Thank you. I will be listening to this soon. Yes, same. Okay. All right, let's go what? talk to Billy. Yeah, what were we doing? We were talking to Billy about her oh, yeah, husband. Right, we're going to talk to Billy. Yeah, well, we got to find Billy. Well, we found Billy. Did we find Billy? Yeah, we found out where her apartment is. It's yeah. 20. Oh, yeah, right. The complex. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know. <laughs> Thank you. It's okay. I got, I got you. I got you covered. <laughs> we're all good. Oh, oh, thank you, Victor, for the Spotify link instead of the Beat Source link. <laughs> we, we were both there. Thank you, Clark. <laughs> we appreciate it. Oh, thank you so much. Also, thank, thank you, you for, for telling stuff. me to get a stand up and get some water. I also, I needed yeah. it. It was a very good recommendation. <laughs> oh. It probably was a good thing that Corey went away because I did need to stand, stand up and stretch. So thank you. <laughs> yeah. This short, that was the drama that you missed is that Corey got up and left. That's all. Oh no, how <laughs> dare she. Right? I know it was a sad day for me, but, um, but it probably was a good thing. <laughs> I do think that I'm I'm reading back through chat and I do think when I inevitably move to New York I am going to put a sign up over my studio that says I'm from Brooklyn I, I fuck, fuck with <laughs> <laughs> and just and just see how that does me in you know everyday life You know what you need to keep you need to monitor it and take notes and see how it works for you <laughs> cuz it might be the trick if it if he taught me anything it's that Apparently There's a it chance, comes like, around and works for you. No, you're right. I might wake up and be like, I'm the shit. And then everyone else will be like, he's the shit. Like, that's how that guy lives his life. And that's Honestly, wild. Like I said, live your truth. Yeah. <laughs> so. The lieutenant motions to you to go ahead and knock. This is the door. You already know it's the right door. This is going to be so hard. Hold on, Kim. We should discuss this before we move on. What should yeah. we expect? Knock? Do we want to discuss with Kim or do we want to just do it? Um, let's discuss it first. Yeah, let's discuss You're right. it. I want to hear it's his thoughts. True. He looks at the apartment door and lowers his voice a bit. We have our first preliminary identification. In all likelihood, the deceased is the husband of Billy Mejean. We need to confirm this as well as deliver the death notification to Billy herself. Now, delivering a death notification is never an easy task. There's a reason why it's often called the most stressful part of our job. This is why it's usually done in pairs. You got this. I'll be monitoring reactions, ready to act if necessary. Do you have any advice on how to tell her he's... What if I don't want to do this? Kim, I don't want to do this. Let's turn around. All right, let's do the top one. Just to see if he has yeah. any advice. Yeah. Yeah. Dad, just don't say that you know how they feel. You don't. Good advice. Okay. Mm, All right. Yeah. I think I'm ready. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah. The lieutenant motions towards the door. Um, look at the lieutenant first. Is this Billy uh, Michon's house? This is the police. Please open the door. Um, I, yeah, I, I guess number two. It's too late. I would do two. Tud Toad, it's oh. too late. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, oops. <laughs> outfit we're doing this in i don't know what to tell you <laughs> <laughs> yeah right f <laughs> you're right i'm so sorry but this is what we're doing. i'm gonna have to... kim could have told us to fix it and he didn't so this is who we are now um all right is this billy michon's home this is the police please open the door uh, it's weird she's not talking, but no, all right. The police, a moment, please, uh, a moment, please give us a moment. Uh, you hear shuffling. There's fear in her voice. She unlocks the door. Come in. The door is open. All right. Oh, shit. Go. I had a window. I could have changed my clothes. <laughs> <laughs> I could have. 
<laughs> no! Oh, damn it. <laughs> what if I just changed right here? <laughs> do it right now. It's fine. Do it right now. Yes, fine. yes. <laughs> this is my nice shirt, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we want to we wanna look nice, shirt. nice and or, wait, <laughs> not, what is the nice not shirt? racist. This one? Yes. Okay. We're going to put on actual real pants. Here we go. Oh, nope. Not those. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Is this uh, it? I'm gonna take off the hat. The hat? <laughs> okay, thank you. Take off the hat. That's a good idea. How's this? <laughs> how, how do we feel about this? <laughs> this is, are those the gloves we want? I suppose. Uh, do we want to have our trash bag out while we're doing this? <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> 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 how do we feel um, about this? It's something. <laughs> I mean, it it definitely is a look. <laughs> It's better. It's better. It's not. It's not bad. Is this better for talking? Is this okay for talking? Uh, it's fine. Look, Let's it's just not, do it. Let's it's not great. I don't have gloves or a hat on. <laughs> That's true. But there's only so I much I can do. We gotta be wearing gloves <laughs> yeah, Victor, and a hat. Like, this is right. We should hold the flashlight in her face. <laughs> I'm gonna put on these glasses. And I am going to equip the flashlight. No. <laughs> no. The flashlight hurt, is so funny. Just like, <laughs> hi, hello. <laughs> oh, there was a moment there where I had no pants on. I hope she didn't mind. Okay, we're great. We did a great job. Okay, you did put the flashlight Hello, detective. Away. Thank God. <laughs> uh, oh, okay. wait. Are we, can we talk to her? It's you from the book There we go. Did you come to bring my cockatoo back? <laughs> she smiles nervously before the smile vanishes from her face. I'm so sorry, oh, ma'am. Ma'am. I don't think I introduced myself properly. I'm Billy. Would you like something to drink? Billy. Tea? Lemonade? We're out of coffee. Billy. The lieutenant Billy. has taken off his foggy glasses and is busy cleaning them in his handkerchief. For now, you're on your own here. He must uh, Kim just baton passed us that over to us. Yeah, he did. <laughs> Straight up. Um, um, okay. Thanks, but I'm all right. I'm not really here for tea. It's not about the cockatoo. Well, let's not joke. We probably shouldn't joke. Although it, it's yeah. sweet. It shows our connection. <laughs> um, yeah. um, thanks, but I'm all right. Yeah, yeah. Is this about Victor, my husband? Oh, shit. That's my husband, too. Some kind of trouble again. <laughs> Oh no, he's in I trouble! Can pick him up in the station, if that's what. Oh no. She stops, her eyes trying to read answers from your face. Keep it together. Mm. You don't want your body language to tell her the news. Sorry, I'm rambling. It's just that Victor often gets into all kinds of trouble. So, how can I help you? How about some small talk before you break the news? Are you sure, Rhetoric? Definitely no small talk. This isn't the time or place. Oh, hey! We can oh. probably do this. Oh, Kim wait, is here. yeah, we, we totally... kept our composure. We discussed things through with Kim. Hell yeah. And Lieutenant's handkerchief. Okay, Ooh, yes, tell her about the dead body. Yes. I feel like we played this great. Mm -hmm. I'm proud of us. Let's do yeah. this. Worked. Please, no, mm -hmm. no snake eyes. You've done this before. Oh, really close. Wow. <laughs> Almost. Shit. Really close Almost, to snake eyes. That was really but close. I, I didn't ask Whoa. for not close to snake eyes. I only asked for not snake eyes. So. Look, you're right. You're totally right. Whew. Okay. It, a pass is a pass. God, do I just say he's dead like that? Or, ma'am, I'm very sorry to say, but your husband, uh, Victor Majan, was found dead in the Martinez boardwalk. I think let's just do it. Let's just do it. Yeah, I think we just what do it. did you yeah. say? Your husband, Victor oh. Majan, is dead. I'm very sorry for your loss, ma'am. Oh. She touches her neck, eye, uh, eyes pale like pearls in seawater. Oh. But he was just... She looks at the kitchen table, where two cigarette butts are still in the tray. But he was just here. <sighs> alive. We understand this comes as a huge shock. I want you to know that me and my partner are here for you, if you have any questions. Take your time. Aww. What happened? Yeah. We are. She turns to you. Her neck and cheeks are covered with red blotches. Her double chin is shaking. It's still uh, early to say, but at first glance, it seems like he slipped and hit his head. It was an accident. He fell through a hole in the boardwalk and hit his head. I think the first one. I think number one. Yeah. yeah. Was he drunk? Mm. 
Alcohol may have played a role. Yes. We don't know yet, but we st- we'll let you know when the results arrive. Yes, that one. Yeah, be kinder with it. Yeah, yeah let's do that. Well, it's also, yeah. we, we haven't gotten the toxicology report or anything like that. Like, yeah, that's it, it true. Definitely we don't know for like sure. He was drunk. There were body uh, bottles around, but there were bottles around in a lot of places there. So just exactly just be that's very true. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I see. She withdraws. And you okay. just found him there, lying in the cold. How long had he been there? If you say two days, maybe it will be etched in her mind forever. It's hard to say at this point. It couldn't have been long. Two days, maybe. Not three. Yeah. Mm-hmm. One or two. I would do one. Okay. Yeah, okay. She blinks, eyes welling up with tears as her hand starts searching for something from the pockets of her dress. Here. The lieutenant hands uh, takes out his handkerchief and offers it to the woman. She nods and slowly wipes away her tears. Is there anyone we could call for you? A friend, a family member, someone who could be here for you? No, Mm -hmm. no. I just need to tell my girls. The air gets sucked out of her lungs suddenly. God, should I call them? Should I tell them to come home? No, a day. Yes, they should know. Do you want us to call them and ask them here? No, take a day to recover. You'll be better prepared when they come home tomorrow. Let's trust empathy. Empathy this, wants us to go too, yeah. Yeah, this is so. an empathy role, so. Mm-hmm, uh, mm-hmm. Yeah. Good. That's probably the right thing. Thank you. She nods, but with a wretched expression. Just tell me, what do I need to do next? Where is he? Can I see him? We've taken him to the city morgue. The local coroner will be contacting you shortly to arrange the funeral. Here's his number in case you want to contact him earlier. He hands her a leaflet with the morgue's contact information. A very good call. Is there anything else that the RCM could do for you? No, I'll call you if something comes up. I'm still... She rubs her face, runs her fingers over her cheek, uh, renders her finger over her cheek that have become numb. Sorry. Thank you. Thank you for telling me. I'll call if... She runs out of breath. Again, Aww. I'm very sorry, ma'am. We should step outside and talk. Lieutenant yeah. nods at okay. the woman and looks back at you, his voice lowered. Set the library card by her. Leave the room. Oh, that's really sad. That was a great sequence, though, because honestly, it's it was- the first time in the entire damn game where I felt like we're actually doing our job. Yeah, I agree. You're so right. We felt like a damn detective. Yeah, right? yeah. Like we, we actually... <laughs> She, like we did something good. Yeah, I mean, it was horrible, we're helping, but we we're... we did the damn thing. We found him. We made sure that he yeah. was taken care of, and we told um yeah. his widow. Like that, I don't know. That was a great scene. Yeah, yeah, that was really good. It was really sad. Um, I also just appreciated talk... how composed both Kurt and Kim were. Like it was just good. Mm-hmm. They handled it really well. Yeah, um, you did well. I will tell you, Gina. Mm-hmm. Almost nothing makes me happier than when you nonchalantly call him Kurt. I'm like, his name is Kurt. But you say it with no irony. You're just like, yep, Kurt. I'm sorry. It's kind of like calling you short. Like, calling him Harry is an active effort now. <laughs> You're right. No, I get it. We have a better name for him. Like... I think... I th- to that uh, to that note, I think it's funny that I call you short and Jake sort of interchangeably. I don't. <laughs> well, well, they're very equal you to know me. Us, yeah, you know us in the middle. Like when I'm there, I am. It's funny. <laughs> my favorite. <laughs> I'm I'm falling into an anecdote, but my favorite moment ever was when like. Gina, I don't remember which one of your high school friends it was. I think it was, it was Danny. There was... I know what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> there was one where, like, she had been coming over to this damn house for years. <laughs> and I had had <laughs> so many conversations with her for years. And, like, yes, I was the younger brother. But I would also spend time with you guys. Yeah. Like, Enough to where they, like, knew who I was. Like, I wasn't, like, that human in the other room, you know? Mm -hmm, And mm -hmm. she is talking to me for real, stutter stops, and without any, like, a little bit of shame, but damn, she still asked, turns to Gina in front of my damn face and goes, what is his name again? (laughs) I only know him as short. She has, she's known you for, like, 
six years at that point. Years. <laughs> and you know what? I felt like, terrible. I clearly... I'm like, I have cursed <laughs> this man. <laughs> I, was like, well, I also like, I, I had and have no problem with short. I have been hearing it my entire life. But also, like, no, it's my not, damn yeah, name. Yeah, it's not your name. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I was like, I can't believe all of my actions have led to this moment. <laughs> oh, I God. love it. Hello. Hi, my name is Short Ryan Smith. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> but it is your name. <laughs> At least Look. <laughs> Guys, we went through a whole thing when I was trying to, like, figure out my stage name because Jake Smith was not going to do it. Where <laughs> I was, like, really, really thinking about, like, Jake Short. Like, Jacob Short. Does that make any sense? Like, <laughs> is there a way to use this somehow? No, it's a, cur <laughs> it's a cursed name because it's a terrible nickname. It wasn't even meant to be one. <laughs> <laughs> but now it's our channel's name <laughs> thing. <laughs> Imagine, though, you see me on a playbill and it says Jacob Short. Like, I feel like all of us, including anyone who's listened to short one game would be like ew yeah <laughs> i would say That's especially awful. those who have listened to short one gaming would be like ew <laughs> oh god oh my god <laughs> that 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 helped break the sad scene yeah. <laughs> glad i could help thank thanks you. thank you brother <laughs> Um, and Thank also, you, Jake. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's me. Yeah. That's my name. Yeah. Hell yeah. If you prefer me to refer to you by your actual goddamn no, like, I, I given literally name. don't give a shit. I just think that story is really funny. It was. It was very, very funny. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, um, how should we respond oh, to sorry. Kim? Yeah, um, back, back in the moment. Um, what now? I could have done more. Great. The case. What now? Yeah. Yeah, what now? I'll call the station when we're finished with the day and let them know the name of the deceased. What about Billy and her kids? That's it? That's it? Uh, I guess... Um, I mean, until we either... until we get the autopsy, there's really nothing to do, but... but yeah, I guess that's, ask, it. That's, that's it. it. That's it? Yeah. That's it. Yeah. We should get back to our case now that our duty here is done. What about Billy and her kids? They'll manage. Yeah. They have to. It's not your place to live their lives. Right. Let's go. Case okay. Closed, well, we got experience for that. All right. And a new skill point. We leveled up. We leveled oh, up. It actually, for All the, right. maybe for the first time, I really feel like we leveled up today. I, I feel like we accomplished. Wow. I will say, well, now that that's over, I can put my normal clothes back on. Your normal clothes. My normal clothes. <laughs> <laughs> my designed what's our, what's our definition of normal here uh it, it, it involves sweatpants and a racist hat so <laughs> oh no my, you mean my casual tuesday wear yeah you know it where's <sighs> my chat chat my name is not josh <laughs> it is not I am my, no you can call me anything but my name is not josh it's too close it's too <laughs> It's too similar. <laughs> Call me Raphael. I'll go by Raphael, but my name is not Josh. <laughs> I support this. His name is not Josh, but it maybe is Raphael. <laughs> it potentially could be Raphael, but damn it, it is not Josh. <laughs> you are not a Josh to me. No, you're really like... not a Josh. <laughs> <laughs> where are we going next that's a what great question know. we just wrapped up a big long um i mean we could we can deal with the um oh wait that looks like tear is that tear? oh wait i don't have my bag oh get your bag out get that bag out <laughs> how can i Hold be walking around stuff. without my bag get that get it get it get it get it get it thank you <laughs> chat's out for you right now <laughs> You did light a fire. You <laughs> did. <laughs> and now you are going to burn. Congratulations. <laughs> Ooh, all of you on that poll, my name is not Josh. <laughs> oh, no, <that's>... <laughs> <laughs> did you find the tear? Okay. Get cool. It, get it, get it, get it. Yeah. Yeah. I guess we can go exchange all of our tear. We and don't get have some that much. Meat? We exchanged it at the end oh. of last time, so I'll just yeah. keep collecting oh. and then. 
Do we have oh. like a primary okay. big quest? I mean, that solve the murder. Right I mean, solve the murder. <laughs> well, yeah. uh, well, you mean uh, that side quest, that one yeah. side quest? So, so okay, the stuff that we need to do right now. Um, we need to. Uh, I did run the number on the victim's armor. I thought. Wait. I thought we did this. I thought we did. Wait, we have to call Alice back. Yeah, I, guess I thought we'll I did that at the that. end of last session, but maybe it didn't save. Oh. Okay. Oops. That's weird. I guess we, we can run and do that again. Yeah, I just thought fine. I did it. That's yeah, fine. that is weird. I Inside, thought you did it too. You see a set of I... steering levers, a radio Recall. microphone, a metal no. drawer, slides the pull-out tool. <laughs> 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 yeah, but I was able oh, to right, we had to call back the second day. In the cabin. Right. I That's forgot. It. We Because mm. the conclusion was, oh, right, this is a... Just keep, just don't forget about it. Um, okay. Oh, okay. So, so tomorrow we have to call back about exactly. it. Exactly. Um, okay. okay. Cool. All right. Do you want me to like set a note? <laughs> no, it will. We'll be good. I think we'll be okay. We'll be good. Um, oh, it's also written down. Okay, in the journal. Exactly. I mean, you can write a note for yourself if you really want. Well, thank you, Allison. I think I <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying. <laughs> so that I personally remember you're right. <laughs> if, it, if it helps you. <laughs> um, so we can talk to Titus um, about the the Mega Mix now that we have more information about it. Ooh, um, we can pick up our dice. We can, yeah. Yeah, I do want those dice. I'm with you. Let's do it. Me too. We have money. Yeah. Yeah, let's because go. we accepted a bribe from a child. <laughs> I mean, look, you're not wrong, but whatever it takes. <laughs> I mean, I guess we could go back over there and work on that. Yeah, I, I figured um, that that makes church. sense. Um, yeah. The question is, do we want to try to solve the riddle? Oh, wait, I can do this. Wait a sec. Oh, cables oh, are unplug it. Into something close to you. Why did you do that? Um. Uh, I don't know why I unplugged it. I do things without reason. I don't. The lieutenant yeah. raises his brows, but doesn't say anything. The electric distribution board now has one cable missing. Did that do it? Did that power off the dice this makers? Orange machine oh, yeah, is dead still. Try and crack. It has a hand cranked ice cream churner and an electric freezer. The ice yeah, let's see if it can open now. Slowly melting. You slip your fingers under the frozen lid, but the ice is too cold. If you want to try again, then you need to have the pry bar in your hand. To take. Thank you, hand-eye coordination. Harder, I think we needed a better pry bar, if I remember correctly, but I can... Oh, oh we, is that we, true? We've, we've been looking for a better one for a little while. Yeah. This yeah. Orange machine if we see that, there's no, a lot <laughs> Yeah. So I guess, I mean, unless we unplug it and we wait and we come back and let it, like... I think that's what Defrost. we were supposed to do. And we yeah. didn't want to do it before because... Um, because of the body. Because of the body in the fridge. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm going to just leave it okay. right now. Well, then let's, we just leave it. Let's check on the dice maker, make sure we haven't ruined her, her whole day. <laughs> haven't, <laughs> like, <laughs> disconnected her power. Exactly. Okay, yeah. Corey, welcome back. Oh, she's back. Corey. Yeah. <gasps> Yay. All is right in the world once more. <laughs> Excellent. There's balance. <laughs> Beautiful. Hello, Bean. Oh, oh she's is a that good a little bean. Mew? Do you want to go? <gasps> yeah! Oh, <laughs> he literally did. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was so good. Chat, if you're not all subscribed after that good content, <laughs> I don't know what's going to get you. <laughs> the little Mew. <laughs> 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 so cute. <laughs> She's I love so that good. you I love that you can get her to respond. <laughs> She's a very good one. Oh. It's very, very again. cute. Are you looking for it's a us. die? I came back to pick up my die. Excellent. That will be ten real for one set of magnetic dice. This was yeah. an especially fun. I love how we're struggling to pay our rent and then also some dice. <laughs> yep, and it's most of our, you know, it's a whole third <laughs> of our money. This was an especially fun set to make, she says. Dazzling. I wish our job it's paid like us. you have a pair of tiny disco balls in your hand. Yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. Thank you. That's nice. We Much appreciated. Let's check what them out. What kind of, I was going to say, what kind of dice are they? Do we know, like... 
Oh, right, right, right. They're like... No, they're not like a special... They're not a... Okay, all right. Well, I'll just... They're like, um... They're those, like... They're like... Not D100s, but like... Yeah, no, they're D100s. Are they D100s? Yeah. Yeah. Ah, nice. Yeah. Cool. And they look like little disco balls. Yeah, wiggle your disco dice. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, wait, was there... I think there's a white check that we might want to do. Have I unlocked it? Oh, it's you again. Oh, it shivers. Are you looking for a die? Oh, well, we'll come, okay. We'll come back, I I'll guess. I'll come back. I, a, a lot of the white checks I've sort of accidentally unlocked. Um, sorry, where are they? I forgot how to get to this panel. There's a whole thing. There, this. A lot of these I've accidentally unlocked just because I've invested points, but I guess not this one. Okay, that's fine. Mm, okay. Um, hmm. All right. Uh, should we head back to... Um, Head back to the church. Yeah. That's probably wisest, yeah. Let's yeah. Go. All right. Let's do. Yep. Go, 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 Let's go, do, go. let's go. Go, 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 go. We can fast travel, too. We can, but I have to get to the whirling and rags before I can do that. Mm. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. But at least there's fast travel, so. <laughs> that is Victor's true. Victor's talking about ice cream. Did you see? Um... No, Brian David yes, Gilbert? Yes, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I have not seen it yet. <laughs> he makes Old Bay ice cream. Old Bay and oh cornbread. Oh my god, the hush. And yeah. Old hush Bay puppy. and cornbread ice cream? Hush yeah. puppy, specifically. Yeah, it's supposed to be like an accompaniment to like a crab boil. Which like, I, oh my god. Crab and hush puppy ice cream? Fuck me up. Yeah. Like, <laughs> you know what? I'm kind of here for that. Yeah, right? Right? Could I'm actually good. here for that. I'm going to queue this up for the future. I also cause... love how it's the only Brian David Gilbert video in like a long time that doesn't have some existential like, like, yeah, twist. Crazy. he's just like, I want to make some ice cream. Here we go. Well, he did the same with the popcorn one, too. He was just yeah. like, That's I want to make popcorn. And it was great. Popcorn was pretty wholesome as well. I... And then I did proceed to go make popcorn after he did that. Oh, and it was did? delicious. Ah. Yeah. It was so he good. Is, guys, everyone annoy him into h- hanging out with us. <laughs> <laughs> that would be amazing. He writes music. He likes theater. He likes games. He likes being a little doo-doo face. Like, we're all friends. <laughs> <laughs> we like being a little doo-doo face. You're right. Honestly, we do. I can see you and him getting along really well. <laughs> There's a certain amount of truth to that. The young man with the tape recorder acknowledges oh, your return. Dream. <laughs> when he looks at you, he squints as though you were the setting sun. This is hardcore. Is it? Hardcore! Hardcore to the mega! Internally okay. coherent. Still say nothing. I was wondering if you knew who killed the mercenary hanging behind the whirling in your ass. <laughs> <laughs> Please tell yeah. me what exactly are you doing? He furrows his Imagine if it was that his simple. His very large head traces the sublime, invisible movement of the music in the very real air of the stuffy tent. Hardcore! He lets, ah. he lets out an agonized roar <laughs> over the feeblish, obviously not too hardcore <laughs> beat below. So hardcore! Oh, oh my god! Whoa! Oh. Egghead! He stops de- dead in his tracks, tilting his he head to the side. You just spun that around on us, huh? It is. I was just thinking that a moment ago. One it mind, is. Oh. One spirit. There's no other world. There's no other life. <laughs> Back to the heavyweight jam. He says, Hardcore. Okay, I'm going to try hardcore, it again. Hardcore to the internally coherent. All com- he furrows his. Ha- is it though? But is it? It is. I mean, really? Feels like you should reply oh. at the very pinnacle of idiocy here, so that things get totally transcendent. But you haven't gotten there yet, so you don't know Damn. what to say. I don't know what to say exactly. Under the radar, over the top. Okay, all right. <laughs> we haven't solved it. We haven't solved the riddle. <laughs> so basically, this is a mini boss in the world yeah. of Disco Elysium. <laughs> is, that, is that the riddle? Is, is, is it? So you're not hardcore unless you live hardcore? Like uh, not hardcore that unless you live hardcore. <laughs> the, cloud, the legend true. of the rent was hard, way hardcore. Hard, 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 hard. He furrows. Ha. Is it though? 
but is feels like you should reply with I am the mic enforcer. I am the chick's checker. Yeah. Damn it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Hi again. Yeah. So, uh, how are things going? <laughs> okay, we need to we still haven't this oh. hasn't upped at all. God damn As it. always, we'll be right Wait, here. you could ask him about Egghead. What that was a new option, I think. Hi again. So uh how oh, yeah. Go? He's Thank a quiet you. man. Mostly communicates through music and by being a master of ceremonies. Uh, what is a master of ceremonies? You know, a host. Sure. A declaimer of slogans. He's a performer. Gets the people going. Interesting, sire. A bit like Gets the people there. going. An MC for short. You know, a master of ceremonies. You... The guy who works in the Kit Kat Club. <laughs> like. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. That's my musical theater humor. Yeah, What's they, up? Thanks, Charles. No, you got it. You got You got a, a, a reluctant laugh pulled yeah. out of us. <laughs> Welcome, bienvenue. <laughs> Welcome. Yeah, there we go. Thank you. No, I, I got the joke. <laughs> but I, I followed through You're on it right. with you. You, you, you yes <laughs> ended, and I just I said no. <laughs> so. And I'm always looking for a yes and, damn it. Yep, you know <laughs> no matter how right. dumb I get, Allison my love that language. You are the, the best comedy partner of, of us. <laughs> okay, wait. That's actually true, though. I feel like my love language is... And no matter how bad it is, I'm like, if you love me, you just go with this bullshit. <laughs> like, yeah. That's sweet. <laughs> That's pretty accurate, it's, honestly. It's, it's, I, it makes me smile. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> yeah, sometimes when I like stumble and find my way into his center, you have to hear a lot of hardcore to the mega first though. The man smiles mysteriously, choosing to let the beat speak for itself. Okay. As always, we'll be right here, waiting patiently for the news. Yeah. I'm gonna try, I, so sorry, to explain what I'm trying to do, we can up our logic to about 28, and we can try that, and if we fail, we can invest a, a point. But a lot of times when things are like this, you can earn points by doing other things in the area. Um, yeah. Like yeah. conversation. So that's. I'm just trying to see if I can earn any points before we dive into this. That's all. No, I no, totally see what close. you're doing. Yeah. yeah. True. Mm -hmm. Hard. Hardcore. I'm gonna Hard see if that did anything. All he furrows his. Ha. Is it though? But is it? Feels like you should. Ah damn it! Okay. Damn it. Do you have to let him what? yell hardcore? You should oh, not so interrupt him. I'm guessing. I didn't. I didn't. Oh, sorry, there's man. no. I got to the end of it. Yeah, I know, but like, should we interrupt him at any point in that, or no? Do you not think that's the that's probably not the way? I guess, but I feel like we've hard done. Oh, hard cut to the mega. All right. Finally coherent. Oh. Wait, try number two. Good morning, yeah. One, two, three. Yako kata, the place to be. I'm beginning to Damn. think this really doesn't have anything to do with the case. Uh, why is why is this? Yakukata, the place to be. What does that mean? Yeah. Yakukata is a hardcore place. Yeah, I mean. All right. Yeah, you can't. It's, yeah. Wait. Mm. Okay. All right. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna. I'm gonna put on logicy clothes, and then when we fail, we'll make a different call. Okay. Yeah. Just give me a moment. That's fine with me. I I like the attempt here. Yeah. So. Might as well. Yeah. Exactly. Get those logic clothes on. I guess, do I have... Do we have a shirt or something? Logic-y logic clothes on? Are we, are we the most logical we that we can be? I think we the most logical that we can be. Okay. Do we want to we want to be logical? Mm-hmm. I guess we do. Okay. Hi again. So, uh, how are things going? Ugh. Okay. Yeah, okay. So Ugh. the speed freaks want to start a club for dance music. That much checks out. Youths like music. You feel as though you might have liked music more when you were young, too. But you digress. Ah, uh, what's the gist of the it? The gist of it is, they want to turn the church into a club. But a suspicious element has overtaken the building. It's very important okay, to understand right, what the gist yes, of things failed. is. Yeah. Always Corey? consult Corey. the gist. Uh oh, what's she do? What's she doing? She did the this thing where she well. puts both of her paws on the side of her water bowl and just tries to push down and slosh the entire water bowl. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you like spilling water everywhere? What does it accomplish? Oh, okay. It brings her Plus, joy. And 
it has to be considered. You can't invent the future of dance music in this smelly old tent. Imagine if you had the church. That settles it. And all right, that it all still right, feels okay, as if right. this didn't... As always. Um, okay, so question. Do you want me to invest points here? Do you want me to go to the church? What, how would you like me to proceed? Well, I, I think we go to the church. How many skill points do we have? Four? No, we have one. We have one, okay. Because we invested all of ours in, in our this. That's right, that's right. Yeah. yeah. Which is um, affecting us minus one logic for what it's worth. Uh, but that's, you know, that is what it mm, is. That's fair. Okay. Um, I don't know. What are you guys thinking? Like, because I think maybe we... Uh, I was thinking maybe we go um, into the church. Yeah, but... I would... I don't know what I would. I started that feeling confident, but then I didn't know. <laughs> um, How many do we have again? We have one. Like, we can invest it in logic and give it a try, but, you know. What is the percentage again? It was like 27. Yeah, so it'll um, up to maybe 35. So it, yeah, but it's, it'll... it's still not going to be huge. We can try that and then go to the the um, church. You know what? We could do that, because then it would still be good for us to have logic. Um, yeah, I mean, you're right. Right? Um... Logic has know. logic comes up all the time. It's true, it does. We are a bit all over the place with our skills. Um, but Hi again, so uh, how are things going? A number of things. Oh, let's take a look. Okay, all right. Okay, okay. I mean, we are going to have to go into the church gather around, kids. eventually. Okay, kids, gather around. I've got bad news for you, Andre. Things don't add up. Okay, kids, gather yeah. around. Okay, kids, gather around. <laughs> young speed freak Give me puts more down money. A busted capacitor and looks at you. The one with the large head seems very enthusiastic about whatever you have planned. Their would-be leader is less amused. Sometime in the past, I'm not sure where and how, I fell sick and became the shadow you'd see now. But before that, I have reason to believe I was a police detective. <laughs> That's so dramatic! <laughs> Got news for you, Andre. Things don't add up. Do we want to do number one? I want to do number one. Hell what yeah. Thank you for your kind words, but everyone in here sees I'm a disgrace to this uniform. <laughs> I, was good, I was getting up in this job to be awarded the rank of Lieutenant um, Yefretier. Yefreder? Yefreder. Um, Yefreder. Uh, I could have yeah. been captain. Imagine that. That one? Um, I, y yeah. Well, yeah, what sure. What happened? Disco happened. <laughs> Uh, life <laughs> tore me a new asshole. I did. I happened to myself. I kind of like that one. I did. I like that one personally. Yeah, that's a real yeah, downer. He shakes his large head. Now, <laughs> obviously, that might as well have been a thousand years ago, but there's still some detective left in me. The young speed freak is silent. He senses something is wrong. This isn't the makings of a club. It's a tent full of a laboratory equipment for manufacturing drugs. Oh. I have no idea how you arrived at that conclusion, but it's wrong. Look, we even have speakers. He points at the speakers. One speaker. They have one speaker. Where is his friend? Okay, that's something, though. Yeah. Like, Did he lose yeah. his friend? Where's the second speaker? You have no headphones. Wouldn't Asel need her headphones to spin tape? The distilled water, cornerstone of a clean lab. Yep. Uh, uh, any of these are great. Um, I like where's his friend or like you have no headphones. Yeah. What yeah. do you know about spinning tape? Nothing. I know you pawn them, likely for lab equipment or drug ingredients. I'm sorry, mm -hmm. but there is no lab equipment and no drug ingredients. What do you mean friend? The other speaker. It's a one speaker system. It's monodynamic. You wouldn't know the first mm. thing about sound reproduction in <laughs> music. Yeah, sure. I like how Jake was like, oh. Yeah, uh -uh. <laughs> the distilled water. And of all cellular based life. What's your point, Lawbringer? There's no need for me to pile on anymore, is there? No shit. In short, you tried to use a police detective to set up a drug lab. That's. Oop. Come on, Whoa. that's. Preposterous against the law, punishable by summary execution. <laughs> Two against the law, I, I guess. To say, not true. So, what are we going to do with you? What do you mean, do? 
There's resignation in his voice. He's almost ready to drop the act. It wouldn't take a lot of pushing. The optimal way to go about this would be indifference. It begins by you telling him you don't care about any of this. We do this lawman style. First you tell me everything, then I pass judgment. You tell me what's really going on and we'll work from there. I can be lenient. I don't really care. I just want to crack the case. Do you, uh, do what you want and I'll do what I want. Two? I guess like, I like number two. Let's do yeah. two, yeah. What do you yeah. mean What's up, Raiders? Lenient? Hey, welcome, welcome. We got the hey, Raiders of the Lost Ark hello. over there. Thank you, you Caddy. Yay, thank you for joining us. <laughs> Um, um, not calling okay. back up and hauling you all off to the pen for starters. Uh, haven't you heard? I'm the dirtiest cop this side of the river. I'll make life hard for you using every connection I've got. And we'll see. I'll speak. One. Yeah, I like that. Okay, man. Okay. Things are just so, so hard for an entrepreneur in this city right now. It's not like we lied when we said we want to turn a church into the wickedest club in East Revershall. Because we do! Mm. We totally do! We just need to turn it into a speed lab before. To get our foot in the door. <laughs> we just need to turn it into a speed lab before. We need that speed seed money for the club first. <laughs> before we can really shoot off into <laughs> our true dream. Oh, children, children, children. Oh. Oh, you've been up for 16 hours and 53 minutes. You should go to sleep. Oh, God. <laughs> no. Sleep, please. <laughs> That's a Holy lot of time. Shit. It is. It's quite wow. a few hours. Um, and why did you need me? Ever? And why did you need me? Yeah. Yeah, why did you need us? To do You're right? really playing for, with fire here, children. <laughs> yeah, right? They are children. Like I told you, spooky assholes moved in while I was getting all this stuff together. A month ago, the place was empty, and now it's all spooked up. No, really. <laughs> here. No, man. They're spooky, all right. It's just that they would also probably call the police if we started cooking speed in them. Okay, all right, all right. But the oh, sign geez. was way off, too. I couldn't feel the love at all. I'm just imagining them trying to set up the speed lab, and a cult moves in. <laughs> <laughs> Our speed lab slash club, yeah. and then the and then You're the like, crab nobody, cult. Nobody saw the crab, the crab cult coming. <laughs> That's so good. God. <laughs> this is it. Judgment time. Give me your cash. Um, <laughs> Pack up and report to Precinct 41. Arrest them. Get lost. I don't want to see you again. Let's do this clean. No speed lab, just a club for Anna, uh, Anna Dick music. Proceed with the club. It wouldn't work without the lab. Do what you have to do to keep the club alive. And I have to look at the spookier situation before I can decide what to do with you. Decide later. I mean, we probably want to look at the spooky situation anyway. It's so up. maybe we do number six and then we come back and we, and we pass judgment. Okay. What do you think? That, I think that's a good plan. Yeah, I think actually. that's a good plan. I not, and then I, I also like the idea of, like, don't do drugs, kiddos. Let's just turn it into a club. Yeah, I, like, I ultimately um, almost definitely have the opinion that we should go with number four. Um, just, just, yeah. just, like, who the fuck? Like, <laughs> Same. Same. I, I realize we, we just did, like, honest, like, police work, I guess. But also, who the fuck are we? So... <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Let's just help them build their club. But for the time being, let's go. Let's go check out the spooky crab cult. Yeah, yeah really I want to see what's going club. on. With... Like, <laughs> we can continue on an amiable path, right? No more misunderstandings. Sure, fine. No more lies. Before you go, is there anything else you need? No. As always, we'll be right here, waiting patiently for the news. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we come all back right. and be like, yeah. Hey, you're that all was going great. to jail. We, <laughs> we decided. We solved a mystery. <laughs> Look at that. I'm proud. Wait, that's getting stuff done. That was getting in I this feel Elysium. done. Yeah. Accomplished. Now, All right, I'm yes. taking my boombox. We're going. You got your boombox. We gotta go find the Where are we going? the spooky okay. fucking crab assholes because I don't know what that means. I have absolutely <laughs> no idea, but I'm along for the ride. Crab assholes. Every Hell yeah. Doors, more than twice your height stand shut in front of you. The lock turns easily. You hear a click as the shackle pops open. I, so did they act the other thing too is that these children did they lock a bunch of people in yeah, here for days at a time so we're gonna find who, out what who that might means. all be dead yeah. <laughs> so 
<laughs> so Let's, that might be part of if we if we if we find out that they threw in uh, voluntary manslaughter murdered a bunch of people uh then that might change your judgment of them a little yeah. bit yeah so as you do you hear the echo of the doom commercial area it's black holes and dusty machines then the feeling passes a great whoosh of air rushes into the dark innards of the church as though rushing to fill a great vacuum in the heart of the city that was very dramatic Oh, yeah. I need to put uh -oh. my moonbox away. <laughs> <laughs> you might want to put your moonbox away. I think we're going to encounter a Whoa! bunch of... Whoa! Check this out! Whoa! Okay. This is a very different zone than anywhere we've been. Yeah. Okay, we're good. A strange stillness fills you as you look ahead. You should walk here, not run. Okay. okay I'll, I'll try. Okay, yeah, we'll do our best. It's not, it's not letting me. It's not letting okay, you move? There okay, there we go. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> like, we're More not going anywhere. More of the forked lightning pattern you saw outside. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, what's that over there? I'm just trying to get some, yeah, feeling for the... Yeah. Some, it's like gnawing on it? Yeah. Oh. The figure looks half finished. Oh, it was being carved. I see. It feels like it's trying see, to see, become one with the church. Okay, here we go. Ooh, I've got chills. Ooh, there's like no music. It's really quiet. Yeah. Yeah. No, this whole space is really interesting. Yeah. Come on. Oh. The only noise is the spinning of the yeah. Two decks yeah. of reel-to-reel -reel tape spinning on empty. Hmm. And then that portable Harman Wowshi tape uh, recorder. Mm-hmm. Is it possible it's recording something? Oh, 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 oh. Something in here, yeah. Someone siphoning electric current from outside into this antenna. Oh, this is one of those whoa. machines. It's the computers. A machine stands oh, yeah, in the yeah. corner, watched over by the figures on the stained glass window. It's turned on. Oh my god, and the sound here. Electric. The sound! Yeah. yeah. Another radio computer. And this time it's already turned on. He seems cautious around the machine. These machines sometimes harbor traps, he thinks. Alarm systems and the like. Let's be careful. All right, this is spooky. We should leave. Yeah. This is it's real this spooky. Bears any connection to the case. Yes, but this machine looks just like the one in the doomed commercial area. It's also yeah. quite similar to the one we have down at the station. Must be the same model. Uh, wait, let me just investigate it. Step behind the computer. Yeah. Look, yeah, let's see. Okay, might have a trap, but I'm gonna try. Oh, you see well. You play and print buttons on the keyboard. A hatch connected to the central compartment is wide open. The lieutenant says nothing. You see the machine's glowing frame reflected back from his diamond-shaped glasses. You're free to proceed. Well. Behind the hatch mm -hmm. sits a cube-like crisscross of filaments smoldering in the dark like fireflies yeah i'd love Silver to roll for traps right says, now <laughs> yeah, <marker>. yeah. <laughs> february to march another filament memory press play to talk with the repeater thoughts um, <laughs> allison yes to all those sounds <laughs> <laughs> Greed. Uh, I don't know. I kind of um, want to press play. I say let's just press play. Let's do it. The speaker yeah. comes to life. Static seeps through the machine's planar magnetic driver. An old lady greets you. Her voice sounds a hundred years old. Good afternoon. Fortress accident on San Brun. This is the East Insulin Indian Repeater Station 1. Please repeat. Is this the personal log? It's the same old woman you it's the same lady. through the radio yeah. computer in the doomed commercial area. Yeah, the uh, the the caravan one, right? Uh, in the doomed commercial area. No, with, no, the this, last yeah, no, this is the other radio computer. One. We yeah, went to. with the with the the the, com the video game makers. Yes, 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 mm -hmm. yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Looked inside the core, but the tape and the filament just says log February to March. Fortress accident, like the one in the doomed commercial area. What are you, a machine? Are you alive? Thanks, but I'm finished with this call. Do we want to look around before uh, we do yeah. this? 
or do we want to just yeah. do number one? Uh, maybe we want to look around first to just find to some know more. The area, yeah. At, like, Both yeah. Both don't. The machine's keyboard. Okay. I could also okay. do print, but let's let's look around for a moment. Yeah, let's let's investigate. There are supposedly people in here, so I oh some shoes, yep. some Mesk Bangers red shoes. I'll cool. Take those out in just a moment. Nice. It's another thing there. Spider has spun a web. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh, now there's music. Yeah, it just got. Oh, it's a hammock. Oh. Is this figure drawn in the frost in the window depicting a deer? Huh. Okay. I'm a little. I'm a little. Oh, and a scarf. Uh, Mask Mayor silk scarf. Okay. Is this the bowl of distilled water? Wait. The silence in this part of the church. It's almost palpable. All the shifting matter and shuffling of living things is gone. Nothing seems to exist beyond the church anymore. Maybe if you were to stand in just the right spot. Even your footsteps would be completely silent. Wait, I think I hear something. And then it's gone. Almost all of it. But for the faintest of hums. It seems oh. the sound here is detached from its source somehow. If not blotted out outright. Truly unusual. You can hardly hear your own breathing. Yell as loud as you can or stomp your feet and clap your hands. Oh, yeah, yeah. Stop your feet like... and clap your hands. You okay. You a few muffled thumps, after which the silence feels even more total. Somehow, your voice is barely audible. Not what? a howl, but the softest of whimpers. What's what? It, there yeah. must be something about the acoustics of the church. Yeah, yeah. That's like, sounds pressing. The lieutenant points pressing. to his ears and shakes his head. Then he leans closer. Can you hear anything? Almost nothing, and it's beginning to worry me. Not really, but it's extraordinary. I've never experienced anything like this. Can't hear shit. <laughs> uh, uh, I guess number number one or two. Um, I wonder I why the yeah. church was built with such strange acoustics. His detached tone conceals how. Well, maybe we can't put a club in here. <laughs> yeah, well, that's true. <laughs> Allison, well, <laughs> good point. <laughs> it might not be good for a club, but it might be good for secretly making drugs in. Yep, um, yep, so. yep. Good to know. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm going to say... I bet it's way better for secretly making drugs if I was to <laughs> yeah. hazard a guest. Uh, um, do you want to do one or three? Uh, whatever, it's definitely real. Something odd is happening to us. I, I, I kind of like number three. Okay. Yeah. The lieutenant doesn't reply, but you can sense him tense up next to you. Look up at the the orderly tower. rows of ceiling yeah. panels become barely yeah. visible, then disappear completely in the darkness of the tower overhead. All right, let's give it a shot. It's full of crabs. Yeah. Damn it. Is it a white check? No, it was a red check, which is why I did it. Damn. Like, oh, we okay. couldn't come back to it, right? I don't nope. think if so. it's a red, I don't think so. No, no, no. Just Nick. darkness without end. It makes your head spin. What's the darkness like? Filled with vague shapes of woodwork. The sense of a great height. It's like you see your own face reflected back at you in a vanishing geometry. A strange, alien image that's supposed to be you. Try to make out something. There's Crap. nothing. You're dizzy and disoriented as you see dark and more dark rising. Officer, what are you looking at? Blink. <gasps> oh, hi. It's what? a crab man. You see what? From the oh, my God. Looking straight it's our friend. At you with dark eyes. Maybe what? it's possible to talk to it. What? What? Hi. Okay. And there's All a right. person just living. There's a person living in it's here. The Is that a man? Looks more like the Phantom of the Opera. Of the it's him. <laughs> and is now studying it's him. you intently. The Phantom of the Opera. The crab. Okay, man. I heard that vibrato. <laughs> I can do it a little bit. <laughs> oh man. It's the crab man. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Um, are you the crab man? <laughs> 
uh, 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 <laughs> what if we say nothing and be quiet for now and see what happens since this space is all about quiet forward a little fixing you with a steady unreadable gaze oh, hey, then speaks Habitual alcohol use has made you into a scared little pussy, Holmes. <laughs> but don't worry. Oh, this is <laughs> you come to Whoa, crab man. Whoa, crab man. Whoa, crab man. That <laughs> crab man really showed up and called us a pussy. Like, come on, crab man. Ow. Crab man. Crab man. Come on, dude. Oh, my God. <laughs> the right for what, crab man? Crab man came for us. Love. And when you're ready, she will take your hand and lift you out of the despair at the bottom of that bottle. This man is obviously a habitual narcotics user. Do we really need to question him? I'm put off yes. by this religious stuff, he thinks. And maybe the ceiling climbing, too. It's all very hard to square with the lieutenant's own view of reality. Hey, and what was that about the bottle all again? All right, electric You haven't even <laughs> drank <laughs> Lay off it already. Sheesh. <laughs> yeah, I guess I have a bit of a problem, and it's been getting out of hand lately, but I'm a policeman. I need to talk to you about police things. I don't know anything about alcohol use. Oh, hell no. Run away. You definitely know about alcohol use. I like number one. <laughs> yeah. Is that through the way? I see deep inside you. Your body and your spirit are suffering greatly from overindulgement, and you don't even know it. Great, more patronizing, so original. Oh, I'm very in touch with my suffering. <laughs> I like that. I, do too. I don't want to read the rest of them. Uh, how do I know? How do you know what I'm feeling? I'm actually Corey. That's my. Stop it! <laughs> oh no! Stop biting my foot! Stop it! I'm gonna do. I'm in touch with my own suffering. <laughs> Not all of it. I was like you once. You don't know all the havoc El Vino is wrecking on your mind and your spirit. Necesita parar, homie. You know, actually, since we're here, you may want to pay attention to what the ceiling climber is saying. I'm working on it. Jeez, everyone's coming for us. I'm working on it, Kim. For some reason, I feel but like you have you. a point there. Uh, yeah. Who do you think you are? Some crazy guy under the roof? What is this shit? You know, alcohol is central to my identity. I wouldn't drink if I it, 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 if I wouldn't. I'm sorry. <laughs> I like that you Good started try. saying it like you were drunk, oh, and then you God. fucked up yeah, the line. Yep, yep, and yep. I tried and I failed, <laughs> or maybe I succeeded. You succeeded. Yeah. <laughs> I think you absolutely succeeded. That was what I heard. Oh man, uh, that's oh, all well God. and good, but we need to talk about the unlicensed occupation of ecclesiastic property. I'm gonna say one. <laughs> Don't trust I like me. one. Trust the mother. I'm only the messenger, Holmes. This is the church of the mother of silence. You are welcome here. Oh, that's why it's so quiet. Mm -hmm. That's very oh, cool. Well, thank but you. That does I'm glad we're welcome. That, like, if this is the church of the mother of silence, it's maybe not the best, again, the best place to build a... a we uh, probably like, don't okay. want to put a club here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you have yeah. no idea what the fuck he's talking about. Is he just trying to throw you off your game? Whatever it is, he's quite confident about it. Just I look don't think we were ever on ways. our game. Nope. We've it never been on our game. My liege. Save him perchance, he hath deceived his very self. This man is a zealot. You must be the crab man. <laughs> <laughs> I really I do love want to call him the crab man. Yeah. You <laughs> must like, be the crab man. <laughs> Never um, I take it you crab. are the crab man. But if that's the name you got for me, I won't stop you from using it. To be fair, it's Her? really more like a spider. If you're not a crab, then what are you? And sorry, you just weren't moving like a human. And hey, your neighbors who came up with the name, not me. <laughs> I like Where? I like uh, one or four, honestly. Four. I always um. thought of myself more like a flame flickering along the rafters and beams. It may be that I gotta work on my technique. You know, it's coming off as crabby. That's yeah, not you're <laughs> the only technique he's working on. Look at those carved sculptures. And is that a satchel of tools over there? Wait, did you also mm -hmm. carve, uh, carve all these sculptures? Sure yeah. am. Whittling wood used to be something I just did to busy my hands. 
Now I use those same hands in service of something greater than my own restlessness. You've got some nice mm. curves going there. Uh, these seem Ooh. a tad derivative. You're promoting the objectification of women with your recreationally, uh, yeah, reactionary Reac depiction of female bodies. And honestly, I don't get it. All these figures look half finished. <laughs> <laughs> Do we want to ca comment on 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 the curvy figures that he's uh, uh, carving? They hot man. Yeah, you know what? Just Call him out. Man. No need to overthink it. What were you <laughs> before you became a crab man? I was in a gang. And, and a wood carver. Crab man. Most of them are already gone. So many people losing their memory. <laughs> Certain sorry, we, sorry, we were not feminist, Tud Toad. We probably we had an opportunity and we shot it down, and I feel yeah. really bad now. That's true. We were too All busy of that's thinking. true. <laughs> okay, he's a damn crab, though. Sorry that that wasn't the first thing on our. Also, it's his <laughs> like... art. It's his art. <laughs> I'm yeah. not gonna judge his heart. His his art. I'm not gonna judge his heart from his art. <laughs> <laughs> True. Um, See, I'm more busy thinking about na 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 na. Where'd he the go? Crab man. Okay. <laughs> He's <laughs> back. <laughs> crab na 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 na. Crab man. <laughs> uh, I like crab man of the opera. Me. Yes. I'm gonna just. I'm gonna just say two. No sure. man. Yeah. You gotta let that shit go. Then the mother's light touch will fill you with rapture. Do you remember your name, sir? The lieutenant is not particularly interested in this information. He's just trying to assert some control over the conversation. Tiago. I appreciate name. you, Kim. But those syllables don't mean much to me these days. A name isn't just your identity, but also, so to speak, your place amongst your fellows, your place in the world. My name I ain't is got Mary. no use for such a place anymore. My name is Harry. My name sets me apart from my fellows. How often do you meet a Raphael Ambrosius Cousteau? My name is Harrier Dubois, and my place in the world is Lieutenant Double Euphrater, and I don't do names either. Names are out. I don't care what mine is. Maybe I like that one. <laughs> I was going to say, I liked one and just waving. Yeah. <laughs> I am, I'm, I am I'm Harry. Harry. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hi, we're Kurt Disco. <laughs> it's a name. Yeah, I mean, I'm not really Harry, but my name isn't actually on this list, so we have to do what we have to do. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Which I guess that would mean number four, but one or four for me, honestly. Short thoughts? Um, I kind of like four. That's sure, not quite four. right. It's kind of a superstar well, thing to some. say. Any one of us could have been anything else. Yeah, I hear you. Mew. We are all one. She we yelling? The yeah. mother's glory. She doing a yell? Yes. <laughs> hey, what's up? What's up? Okay. No. She gave me a look. <laughs> uh, <laughs> like, how dare you say those words at me? <laughs> <laughs> all right. I know. I know. It's it's later than we normally go. So, do we want to next time pick up in our interrogation of Crabman and see see oh. where that goes? I know we usually start don't start off with the crab man. Yeah, we usually don't end mid conversation, but I think this might go on for a bit. We're already pretty over. Um, I think you're right. right. Think this yeah, you like a long, a long thing. I but this is a really, yeah. this is a really cool thing to come back to, though. So I'm really excited that we have this to look forward to whenever we return. I um, do wholeheartedly agree with that. Yeah, yeah, and we got a scarf and we got some shoes, which might have been crab man's scarf and shoes. Um, but we have them now. Really so. looking all right, <laughs> all things considered. <laughs> I mean, he crawls around in the rafters. He doesn't need a scarf and shoes yeah. anymore. So, like, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Oh yeah. That's a that's <laughs> the, a fucking look. The outfits look. in this game are are <laughs> something. I gotta say. <laughs> They're oh, gold. Boy. Some animator had a black. They did. Yeah, indeed. right? Indeed. <laughs> All righty. Well, we will wrap up here. Thank you so much for joining us, everybody. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your week. Uh, and we'll see you next time, I guess. All right. Everyone see you next time, folks. So well. Subscribe, Bye. like our Twitch, <laughs> follow us on YouTube and Twitter and, yeah. and all of that, but and also TikTok get some rest. And <laughs> no, no, no. 
Find us on all the social media, and then you can sleep. And then you can sleep. And then you can. <laughs> then you're allowed. Hydrate. And then you can. Then your watch is ended. Then your watch is ended. Excellent. Fantastic. Uh, see you all when next we stream, whenever that may be. <laughs> see you guys. Bye. At Christmas. Bye. 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 Bye.